Mose. We're going to call this number two? Episode two. Episode two. Like, two. It, what, what this is is Wild Animals Reloaded. Episode wild two. Reloaded, okay. Season 1.5, episode two. Reloaded. <laughs> now, normally, you might be used to seeing us on uh, Twitch and stuff like that. We figured uh, to get a little more, you know, <coughs> side of it, we got to go on to a, a, a platform that's going to let us be because, you know, we don't want to risk a ban on Twitch. So we're like, I mean, like I'm live right now on YouTube, Trovo, Facebook Gaming, and uh, I'm assuming a ban from one of them is going to come eventually. You but, know what, though? Are you really going to you really going to be? This is not my main. Anymore? Yeah. It'd be yeah. like my side chick calling in sick. At least this is not my main. You know what I mean? It's. I'm just saying. Wow. <laughs> I can't come into jerk work today. <laughs> wow. What? 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 Oh my what god! Up, got, what up? You got the ruler already. <laughs> yeah, you know this is <laughs> this is my power object. That's the I power think before object. every hour, he like psych himself up. He measures his cock. He's like, mm -hmm. yeah, dude. <laughs> this is a half an inch bigger than. Dude, I'm I'm a good right. eight inches, dude. I'm a good no. eight inches. He's like, say when? Say when? <laughs> Seriously? Seriously? Oh, dude, I'm gonna start over. Are you serious? R really? Like, what is that off of? What is that off of? Uh, that is off of the show called uh, New Girl. Oh yeah, and it's like I'm, a, I'm gonna like, go again. I'm gonna go again. I'm gonna go again. <laughs> Seriously? Seriously? Are you, I'm gonna start over. Seriously? That's a good show. I that love that show. show. Oh, fuck, I've good. never known another guy that's like that show. Dude, I've watched it all the way through. <laughs> my my girlfriend uh, just watches like, it around me, and I just. Uh, Ended up liking it. It's I think you're lying. I think you're lying. So I'm gonna do a weird concoction real quick. So I got Mountain Dew Live Wire. I'm gonna okay. pour what about it? half of this in here. Hold on. There okay. you go. About half of that in there. With vodka. I got That's some amazing. Old Orchard 100 percent uh apple juice. I almost called it orange juice, but it's not orange juice. Okay, I'm kind of with you. Apple juice is very and then we're gonna yeah, add just a little juice. bit of crack. Yeah, a, little, a sprinkle in just, a just a sprinkle of crack. Okay. Yeah, I got the crack right here. Just a sprinkle. Oh, are you putting, are you putting that in there? <laughs> that's the yeah. crate. That's the kratom. Heat that up in a bent spoon, silly. Oh, well, I'm new. Okay, I'm David. Sorry. David, hold on. Wait, what the <laughs> fuck is that? <laughs> is that kratom? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Have you, you done this before, Dave? You, you don't know, shoot the whole happen? thing of kratom. You just do the cap. Uh. Yeah, you just do the cap. This thing's like fucking. When do you bucks. when do you use yeah, the needle? Expensive. This shit's super expensive. And you, I, are you smart enough to hide it underneath your toenails so you don't? Uh, see it? it tastes like goddamn shit. David, when do you like inject it? it? Yeah. Uh, whenever you feel like it, like yeah. between your toes, so that people Dude, can't see your. Fucking, you can see it on the bot. Like I guess I can't really. You can kind of see it. I oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that thin layer. Fucking you need nasty. a spoon. Dude. I need a, a spoon. Yeah, I need to go yeah, mix it up. Mix it I up, need I'll use this. You need so a I spoon. Heard Kratom, I, heard, I heard Kratom shrink this looks your, like Dude, you're going to get tetanus. I heard Kratom makes you, make you so? shorter. If you use that, you're going to get tetanus. Oh, ah, yeah, dude. It's that, worth the what? risk. Is that a spear fishing? Oh, my Bro, God. Oh, that is a tetanus, tetanus co cocktail right now. You didn't oh even clean God. it off. That's <laughs> probably worse than tetanus, dude. You're going to get You guys like, got tuberculosis <laughs> yeah. hep C. I don't know what there, our There, there are people out there that use Kratom medicinally. He's got and he's going to die, and they're going to say, we saw him okay. take Kratom right before he died. Yeah, news flat. Yeah, it's going to be on the news. Kratom kills Professor. What up, Brendan? Yeah, yeah. That motherfucker hey. tasty, boy. He died. He also had tetanus, no. but we're going to, we're going to, we're going to forget hey, about that. Hey, shout out to my you boy. You get a shot Abe, for that. Hey, Frankie. <laughs> Yo, you're out there. Appreciate you, Frankie, hooking me up. Yo, you hey. got a local gas station, and his name, I'm assuming, wasn't Frankie. <laughs> <laughs> hey, honestly, and you were like, you... "Is this stuff safe?" And he did this. <laughs> he doesn't. He doesn't. Uh, have to? He's he's uh he's deaf or mute, and so he he only operates in in sign language. And, and you don't so, know sign language, and this means really dangerous. Hey, that actually sounds like a good premise for a, a TV show, where this guy is just mute or deaf or whatever, only operates in sign language. Uh, he's the main character, but every episode it focuses on the one drug deal that he had where they interpreted his interpretation very incorrectly. And then it <laughs> focuses on the guy and everything he does after that is based on what he did, which had nothing to do with what the guy's reaction was. So, I, for example, lost it, yeah. for you example, lost me too. if you go and do a drug deal and he's he does 
And then so he's like, all right, so it's good. So then deaf mute drug dealers out of the picture for the rest of the episode. Then it focuses on him. <laughs> he goes back to his who to the trap house and he's like, Yeah, the dude said we're good to go. We're about to get lit. Let's do it. So then they do all the drugs and then a whole shit storm happens. They get fucked up. They go to the hospital and there's a whole story behind it. And then at the very end of the episode, it goes to the drug dealer and he's just like at home playing video games or something. I'm gonna be honest, like, you still lost me. Yeah, it sounds like you need to get in. It's in my head, head. okay? Yeah, it's in it my sounds head. Sounds like you need to I, be a director. Really. I could have made a movie similar, quicker, and more understandable. They, so by, what? What that? Saying, it's a Mr. In Bean, my head. A Mr. Bean character doesn't doesn't talk, doesn't really yeah, do anything, yeah. right? That's a, but that's he's, a good but, concept. But, that's but what I mean. the Mr. Bean, but he's an assassin. You know what that so, was? Like, he mixes the poison, and somebody comes up, and, and they go to drink it, and it's not the person he's trying to kill. And he's like. And they drank it and they died. <laughs> Mr. Bean Assassin would have you, I don't know. I can't even think of. I'm trying to play your movie in my head. And it's no, like, dude. Lo, so no, this is what. It's similar to that. It's similar to that. Listen, That's, this is literally what it seemed like David was just doing. It's like he was watching a show that we couldn't see. And he was trying to describe what he was seeing live to us without us being just, able to no, see it. That would have been better. I think it, it was. he was like, all right, so listen, guys, real quick. Quantum physics. And he just went into this. And we're like. <laughs> They no, that's Shiv's department. He he's all about quantum kind of, physics. Yeah, I'm like, not gonna. I, there's no way I'm trying to. He went into how like physics. immaculate conception, and I'm like, <laughs> I don't, I don't know what to do with my hands. While he I said talk. the the know. God particle. You know, he started talking about the Big Bang, and he was like, No, no, no. That, uh, I had four large chicks last Wednesday. The Big Bang. <laughs> <laughs> you missed it. You missed it. I still smell like Turkish beef. David, is that going to be your shtick, the ruler? <sighs> yeah, it's my power yeah, that, object. That ruler, I'm now. telling you. Yeah, Honestly. You before every, did you see the little marks? See the little marks? Only he can lift it. He's the only he's one still, worthy. He's, he's a grower for sure. Oh, let me see. He's for a sure. grower for sure. For sure. Like, is that, that, that a metal ruler? Is it made of metal? Yeah, it's plastic. Hey, real quick, if we, if we have an honest moment in the circle, uh, grower. Are there any showers in, the, in this episode? I'm not a shower. I'm not a grower. Are, are you are y'all are one of y'all secretly sitting there with the seven right now do you do you guys know right now hold on hold on hold on hold on <laughs> yeah they can, he literally can tell you right? he said let me wake him up yeah. <laughs> come on boy, are there come any, on, boy. Are, do, do, do you think you knew any any showers because i listen oh. my high school we yeah, did a lot yeah, of freaking yeah. not we one a, shower amongst the group we got <laughs> our, we got our a good guy. buddy we called him M md for Monster Day. That was his nickname, MD. What up, Playboy? Oh, it, it was already? Oh, yeah. When it was soft, it was like fucking eight inches long and veiny. <laughs> yeah, and, it was nasty. And veiny. Yeah, and, and, I shouldn't say was. I shouldn't say was. And then, and then, and then when he gets excited, it actually gets smaller but stands up. No, it gets bigger. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, it gets it, it like whoa, It whoa, like, whoa. does like a weird angle. Like it gets this. bigger, bro. No, okay, so Brendan said, away. I'm a grower and I'll show it off. What up, Mipo? <laughs> How do you know it gets bigger? <laughs> just He's from like, just from knowing like, chicks that did it tastes like him shrimp, and from him, chicks that were made for the rest shrimp. of their no, life. The chicks, the chicks that were banging him, right? Maybe they just saw the hard version. Like, oh, that has to be. It got bigger, right? They never seen the, right? I don't like, imagine. Imagine he he sleeps with a chick because you know he's 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 excited. He sleeps with her, and then it goes soft, and she watches it not shrink. Because like I've had chicks just watch and be like. It gets so tiny. <laughs> Where did it all go? I've had a chick tell me, how did that turn into that? Uh, it, it was, it was, and then it, like, imagine he just gets off the chick's like, it didn't, it, that's it? It just went to sleep. It didn't get, <laughs> he's tired. That's it. That's, that's impressive. When you, that's when it, you try to convince them that it, it does it. It doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't come, grow it any just length at all. all. It just, it. just straightens up. Yeah, you're right, Squazzy. I'm glad I didn't go live on Twitch. <laughs> yeah, 100%. I used to tell I used to tell a chick I was dating, I'd be like, it was like soft and I wasn't excited, and I'd be like, hey, hold it. And she's like, really? I'm just just hold it. And you're lucky because I don't, I let nobody hold it. Just hold it. And it would grow, and she's just like, How does it turn into that? And I'm like, Give it a pet. Give it a pet. I don't know. I really don't know, man. I don't know how it turns into that. Hey, Kev, it's cool. We were we were late too. We were late getting on. So. Yeah, we, yeah. We were about I, fifteen I minutes. Right? Like, it was my fault. I overslept like a motherfucker. <laughs> we were all nine nine fifty five, and my lady goes, "Hey, uh, you doing wild animals today?" And I was like, I, my brain was like, "It's Friday." And I was <laughs> like, "No, it's tomorrow." And she's like, "No, it's not." And I fucking. <laughs> Me, yeah, we were like, sitting oh, in chat for like, we were there like nine nine fifteen. Like I don't know, if squads is coming today. Well, I was like, I was like, he would tell me if they were canceling. 
I should have called you. Yeah. Well, so well, I I told them I was like, now that we got everything figured out, everybody knows what they're doing. Mm-hmm. Like you know, there's no sense in getting on an hour ahead like we did last week. Oh, well, that's you know? true too. That's true too. Because we were saying like all of our thoughts that we were like, you know how much like, oh, let's save that. I want to tell that story, but let's save that for the you know for the show. Yeah. And, and then we and, never end up telling it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So the the obvious thing to get into right now, if if I I, I know. I watched a couple different people. Now, here's what we're gonna try and do before before we jump in. Here's what we're gonna try and do is we're trying not we're gonna try our best to not, not name names. names to not yeah. specifically say this person or this streamer or whatever. But did everybody check out a little bit of the uh, Call of Duty Up Next event? I guarantee they did. Todd, uh, I no, I watched uh, what's his name? I've uh, never even heard of it. Ninja. Uh, you yeah. watched Ninja? Yeah, you can say. You I can thought say we weren't saying names. Uh, only when we're talking about only in a derogatory sense. We can't yeah, talk we, about we, it. We didn't preface it. If no, you're, if you're like even mad about. props, name names. But if you're like this person's a dirty cheating. Oh no, I wasn't giving him props, dude. I watched him for five minutes. I was like, turn this, this dude's guy. trash. Oh, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, uh, that's that's all I got. Actually, it was funny. Up D2? Uh, Ninja. He was the dude who got famous off of uh, playing Fortnite. Yes. Oh, that's who the, Ninja had is. Had the blue hair. Had oh, the that's who hair. Ninja is. Yeah. Well, I'm tell- telling Chip. <laughs> I know who he is. Chip knows who Ninja is. Yo, you'd be better Everybody off being like, so Jesus. Is. Okay. Listen. <laughs> he walked on water. Sometimes you see you know him on the side is. of the road. You'll be on a billboard. You know who Ninja is. Hey, speaking no, of hey, Fortnite. Um, speaking of Fortnite, Travis, hold on, hold on. that video you had the other day of you playing Fortnite was dope. I didn't know you played. Love you too, when you were the Halo guy. And you killed like four. Uh, no, they're on the counter. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Go ahead. What was it? Well, oh, my I Fortnite. Guess, dude, that's that's rude. Yeah, oh, well, you know what? You're like who are you trying to kiss? Four hundred miles away. <laughs> you got a kiss? I was just trying to get one. Come here, Joe. Uh, <laughs> Joe Montana's gonna give you a smooch. There you go. <laughs> okay. All right, Squadzy needs a moment, guys. <laughs> that's tennis. He's getting tennis. Oh, uh, someone's, cl- someone's clipping that. Someone's <laughs> clipping that. Oh, uh, make that a gift. Okay, that's so sorry, gift. Shiv. My Fortnite clip the other day. Yeah, it was good. I didn't know you played Fortnite. I, I was here I and was there. Cool. We don't play about no. Yeah, so okay, like, I was in the middle of a story. Full disclosure. <laughs> they just blow right past the drama. He was like, I was literally talking. It's it's fine. It's fine. Nah, his story. You know, right. I can pick David's then. Acknowledge it. He goes, Hey, Shiv, uh, you. <laughs> Get it on chat. What are you saying, Dajama? Woo. Uh, something about ninja. Uh, oh no! I oh, you the story. Uh, his story was over. He was talking about ninja. He was telling him how he's a Fortnite guy, I, I telling everyone Warzone. who games that who ninja is. Go ahead. New Warzone or the co- new Call of Duty. Yeah. Uh, watching Ninja play, I saw it off of T Pain's uh stream and went to Ninjas, and then it, I thought it was Battlefield for a second. The way it looked, I thought yeah. it was literally Battlefield. Yeah. The I new can see that. Twenty forty two or whatever, but. Uh, looked at a thing that was Call of Duty. I'm like, oh shit! And it, it it makes sense too because there's people in the background from when he was streaming. I'm like, why the where the fuck is he at? There was 200 you know, people all right there on land. Yep. Yeah. And it's so squads. Go ahead. Go ahead. Being being that it was land, and you're surrounded by Call of Duty <laughs> devs and everything, and you had to use their setup. The only thing you were allowed to add to that, from what I understand, is your OBS settings. For your streaming well that i think you, you could bring your own controller and or mouse and keyboard but that was it yeah yeah, yeah. computer it's their their setup so they you had to use their headset too everyone so all had the same headset. use your aimbot you couldn't use your walls you couldn't and i'm telling you there was a couple of streamers that never miss a shot <laughs> so many shots like one in particular i watched and then re-watched it and then re and this person shoots to the left of the person riddled up into the air and didn't even try to go over to, and they're like whoa you never you you rely real heavily on something else you clearly never miss in 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 your house on your setup you never miss and uh, so a lot of people are saying that like you know it's a new game there's new mechanics to the guns different recoil patterns different things like that i get it i get that for the first two games jeezy not even not even just the first two games I I get new game, new mechanics for casuals. New game, new mechanic don't mean shit when that's what you do for a living. You're a partner on, on, on platforms. You play this game 24-7. It's not like they told them, 
hey, all these COD players that are rocking it in Warzone and dropping 40 kills, come over to play, but we're going to play Fall Guys, and you've never played it. So it's, it's not a new game. It's not something yeah. different to them. It's a shooting game. Point, click, aim. That, well, that's what I was saying, like too. You don't, lose your, to aim. you don't lose all your hand-eye coordination that you, would ha that you have. Or your game sense. Well, yeah, and like it's like you pop around the corner and you start shooting your teammate. And then there's right, an enemy right. right next to him, and you don't even try to go over and shoot at the enemy. Or or the other person I was watching that uh, normally, normally, I'm telling you, Google it and you'll watch. Normally, always locks on to the left knee. Are you it's talking about in uh, in his, at their house? Or yeah, on their house. house. At their house. Left, the left, knee. Left, knee, oh. left knee locker. And you'll see some. there's a wall. And then the person pops out from the wall, and you can watch it in slow motion where his cursor goes right down to the left. It stays knee. on the knee. Left knee all the time at this event. It couldn't Dude, find the him. shots were yeah. all over uh, the place. I need to know, even though we're not doing names, I need some sort of hint to figure this out. What, I'll what text you. you. I'll text week? you right yeah, now. When we end the show, we'll just tell you. <laughs> yeah, but what about the viewers? They need to, They need some. Oh, they, they just know. They it. know. Everyone in my chat knows who we're talking they, about. Oh, oh, same. They know. Yeah, but we're trying to reach new people. They might not they, know. They probably know too, David. Oh, all right. So speak, speak, speaking of this, 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 this is why we don't really name names a little bit, a little bit, a little bit about it. Is y'all know uh BBB, right? Uh, Best Buy, right? He has, BBB. BBB. He, he, Best he, he, he's a creator who is his entire platform is calling out cheaters. <coughs> oh, okay. He put a thumbnail up recently that yeah, we 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 like to expose a cheater to be like, yo, this, this person's cheating without like name dropping them to like bring hate and stuff their way. We just want to expose the fact that, yo, the other's cheating or whatever. This dude straight up said, what is thumbnail? This bitch. <laughs> and it's this like, that's cheating. too far. You can't do that. You can't do that. Kevin. <laughs> you can't do that. You I'm can't on BBB side. Like, so, do, like, you have my, do you have my stream pulled up? <laughs> you can't do that. Kevin's putting it in one letter at a time. <laughs> I did see <laughs> Kevin. No, Kevin, I did no, see him. I did see a meme <laughs> that mentions this human, uh, and it was about like COD streamers <laughs> when this human's name isn't brought up every thirty seconds, and it's that meme with the veins yeah, I, popping up. That's another reason we don't do it. Is we don't what want you're doing them when getting you call attention to a specific person is bring people to that specific person. Yeah, more to attention them. to them. If to I watch. if I ran into that person on Call of Duty shit on them multiple times even though it would be a very popular tiktok on my part i would not make it because you'd just be into the the zeitgeist of just mentioning that person to get the views and it's funny when you go to some of these go to some of these pages that have mentioned that person go to their tiktok it literally you watch their video count 200 200 200 200 140 you're like they literally use the name and say how was that it's it's that effect. Oh God! It's uh, of speaking of the BBB, have you ever seen clips of that person playing? A little bit, a little bit. Terrible. <laughs> well, I saw I saw a clip recently Terrible. where where uh, shots weren't registering, and it could be a glitch. But oh, that's, that's also up. something that Ricochet was doing is not letting your shots register. And I was like, wouldn't that be ironic if he was cheating? <sighs> You know what I mean? Yeah, he yeah, catches all the cheaters. It's his cover-up, dude. Yeah, that's, that's why he, he does. does it. Right? And 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 then there's uh there's Twitter posts. This 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 is something that like I was deep in the rabbit hole last night watching videos of a lot of these streamers that are big time that get called out for cheating. You play a video in slow mo and you see that before the guy even pops out of the wall down there, he's locked onto their waist or their shoulder or their knee. A lot of them now start talking about it on stream in in ways like this brendan that tweet oh, that tweet this isn't working brendan that tweet the other day they mentioned what? uh that what? tweet that you you're probably talking about where they had to make a new account that was that was a troll on their part where someone tweeted that their account got banned and they said what the fuck oh yeah that's just, it, it was that was a troll it was yeah, a troll to try to there's a lot of fake trolls out there posting <laughs> shit that when it, 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 it's the same way you dispel a conspiracy theory. Our government does it. Is let's say there's a conspiracy theory that this happened, right? Our government will go, okay, all right, now release conspiracy theories about everything else. Like 
flat earth and lizard people and just go. And then you go, oh, everything's crazy. All, all hey. computers are crazy. Yeah. Right. Lizard oh, yeah, people, yeah. that's no conspiracy. Yeah. Bro, you lizard seen Umbrella people, Academy? People are real, dude. They're interdimensional lizard people, actually. Yeah, interdimensional you, lizard what? people. I've done my research. Yeah. They're turning all the saying, frogs Alex gay. Jones, the Alex way you Jones dispel Jones. it is put a bunch of crazy shit out there, and then they go, oh, conspiracy theory, you're crazy, right? Yeah, so yeah. when you put a bunch of crazy shit out there and fake troll accounts of that type, people, yeah, then, whenever you accuse somebody of cheating, ah. Well, uh, and... Uh, and a lot of them defend. There's a clip go, like goes around where they're talking about, oh, oh, a Cronus. Yeah, yeah. So and so uses that, and it's a it's another famous streamer talking about a famous streamer. Right. Or, or, or like I was saying on stream, they'll admit it. They'll be like, they they do. I watched a bunch of fucking like big times. Well, the thing is though, like, like Cronus isn't working. Or oh, I had it set to his knees, and then he goes, I adjusted it. But that's the thing, though, is that they're that's a troll. They're not. They don't actually. I mean, they probably do actually mean it. But the person it's that being has it's be to his knees. Then you watch all the videos. You go, oh, he locks to the left knee all the time. But but they market that as a troll. That's what I'm saying. Right. The society goes, oh, he's trolling. No, he's trolling because he knows he's been caught, and the way to cover it up is to just start joking about it and trolling. Yeah. And being like, oh, my Cronus ain't working. Oh, I locked to his left knee. <laughs> and the problem is they've got so many fanboys and fangirls that we talked about it last episode. Do you know what? I think you become more famous by cheating quicker, and we're all like, yeah, 100% yeah. true. You the guys tweet, are doing it wrong. I the mean, tweet went out of... Sounds like you guys need to start cheating. The yeah, tweet you guys went out just, of this person and this can't person. Can't beat them, join them. And the tag was, with these two people standing next to each other, the tag was best female cheater, best male cheater in the world. Why do you think They're I switched to two-handed event. bowling? Yeah, that's basically cheating and bowling. Basically yeah. aimbot. A lot of there are some people that don't don't <clears throat> like two handed bowling at all. Like they really do think it's like cheating. Well, the but. thing. So the thing is though that, and this is what a lot of people say to me when I bitch about aim assist. Then play on controller. Then then two hand bowl. If you think it's it's an unfair advantage, then, then bowl two handed. Right. Yeah, and it, and so that's true. And that's true in a certain I sense. I always do say that to you when you say, "Oh, it's aim assist." Like, I'll play with the controller. I no, because I'm actually, I'm I'm better on mouse and keyboard. <laughs> and the the Yo, thing you about like to say aim assist is op so often, I'm bro. Like, I play on controller, it I is. You hey, okay, Trav, you did switch to controller for a little bit for like no, a week you used or something. To play controller, and then you well, I know, but I'm not. I'm talking about because after it... he got became actually good oh, at okay. keyboard and mouse. If which, by the way, OP, Trav, use it. That's fucking impressive. Go like you got so good at keyboard and mouse so quick. Like you Thank surpassed you. your Keats controller that. abilities. That's what I'm saying. So this is really so this quick. is what I was trying to Keats like. I what what like it's why I'm, I had plateau, plateaued <laughs> on on controller. I was not wow. getting any better for yeah. years. Like for two oh, years, man. I was yeah. Magnetic bullets. <laughs> I, mean, I, I I've seen I've Wanted. seen clips, I've seen clips of Trav where I go. Okay. <laughs> Okay, how do you hit that? Yeah, Travis <laughs> over there. He's been cheating for years already. Okay. So, <laughs> dude, I have. What he did was he infiltrated a uh, he infiltrated a group where he's like, we we hate cheaters. You'll never know, man. You'll never know. You're never gonna find <laughs> me <laughs> out, man. And like every three days, he'll bring up somebody and be like, I think this person's cheating, and he's like, they'll just never know. Oh, I just figured cheating. out my seat goes higher. Just, oh my god! I never I never use it unless I'm eating. Travis, do you but, use a gamepad for your left hand, or do you just use WASD? WASD. That's crazy, dude. That's so WASD's it, nuts, dude. That's on gang signs. This is this is WASD right there. You need to get a gamepad. Like what? No, what I don't. It literally, I, like fits your hand. Oh, hold, please. <laughs> WASD. Do you have one? Yeah, he's got the. We've we've all got the thing. Oh, he has one too. But yeah, he doesn't play mouse and keyboard. I wonder if I could do that. So oh, like, dude, you try it. That look and weird. You still like it. Yeah, that thing is, uh, I, I can't use it. But so I not easy. I okay, yeah, I have the exact same thing. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> we get it. You got the exact same thing. <laughs> Calm down. So Let me it's turn comfortable. This down. It fits. It's got the joystick. So you can do your, you know, once yeah. you keep mine it, you'll be fine, right? But Dirt Pronos, what's up, Dirt? What's up, Santana Impulse? Everybody, um, Dirt Pronos actually has the, the one. Azeron. Azeron with the up tops, and you can, like, 
Yeah. I want that one, but Dirt said he didn't like it. Hey, imagine if All right, guys, that on a serious I'm... note. Her Star own... Star Trek? <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but imagine if they made that thing an actual mouse, and then you could play like VR games with two hands and move around your hands <laughs> yeah, and yeah, yeah. independently with that, the you that do that? double mouse system. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, just you know, you guys yeah. just wear glasses. Glasses are the way. So I tried to play on stream like this, and I'm like, I can only see this much. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, I'm trying to hit people. He was playing on six thousand FOV. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, <laughs> Cod's famous for doing this. Speaking of the event, Cod's famous for inviting somebody out to an event, watching them play, letting them go through the whole entire event, and then when they go home, banning them. And I'm curious, as one person, if they really person, do that. Yeah, yeah, they've done it before. They've invited you out to an event, let you play on their system, and went, "That was awesome." That's confirmation right there. Ooh, breakfast. Ooh, Yo, breakfast. Take us out. Take us out. Take us out. Homemade Cheddar Bay biscuits. I cannot eggs. believe those are gluten free. Oh yeah, gluten and they're fucking delicious. Oh, steak they are. Eggs. Yeah, steak and eggs, homemade cheddar bay biscuits. What's up? So I was actually thinking about bringing hey, this up because is there I ketchup or hot sauce on top. It's ketchup. Oh, ketchup. That that's blasphemy to me. <laughs> hey, nice stream with you guys. Good seeing you. I'll see you guys next week. Bro, listen, listen. You don't put ketchup. Uh, this eggs. Is the hey, man. hey. Do you put ketchup? I put hot sauce all day. Do you put ketchup on mac and cheese if you do? I'm out. Leaving the Zoom call. Ketchup no, on mac and cheese. Yeah. Yeah. Pasta it's just mac and cheese. It's disgusting hey, some, that people do that. some death nut shit on there. Take a death <laughs> the powder. Nut, a little bit of that powder Yo, on top. I'd rather that. take a nut on here. <laughs> <laughs> and then eat that. Yeah. That death <laughs> is no fucking joke, man. Yeah, we that still was need to get fun. our boy. Dude, I threw. So, hey, we have uh, an update. We have an update. Because we went straight over to Dave's after that, and we were fucking went to lay his floor. And we ended up having to chip up all this old vinyl flooring. And we were literally, it was so old and stuck to the ground that it took us five hours to chip it all up. And we're sitting there with like crowbars and, and like. We literally, chisels, near the chisels. end, we were chiseling. Kev, disown your sister, bro. We, and like had our, we had our shirts wrapped around our Y'all got asbestos you know? all we over like you. Singing. We were Probably. singing fucking slave songs. <laughs> no, this house was made past and, 1968 it's and we good. were me and dave were like feeling so sick the whole time from that fucking nut like dude it day, fucked me up all day burning and we're like doing physical labor and i'm sweating and my insides are just churning it was not good dude it, it was, was rough dude that dude, was such good. bullshit how long it took for that goddamn flooring yeah we didn't oh even think God. we were gonna have to take it up so we did not make any plans for it like Stupid. we just had to improvise as soon as we started. It was horrible. Well, look at Squazzy. What the fuck is he doing? <laughs> he just catch up the eggs. <laughs> He's like, don't shave me. He he puts ketchup on steak. Look at this motherfucker. No, that's nah, good, nah, nah. Ketchup and steak is rocking, Santa. I don't don't that's I don't good. knock until you've tried it. No, bro. No. Man, no, that's look great, right. dude. I agree. I got my fucking cookies, boy. Ooh, you stole some from Homemade that. Uh, Bay oh, you know what did? Shit. Those Homemade Cheddar Bay biscuits are <laughs> fucking bomb, dude. That looks like crystallization going on on top mm. of that thing. Hot sauce on eggs. Yeah, I'm down for that every day. So I made these, <coughs> right? And I made some butter. Nice. With the nice garlic. Butter. Oh. All up on top. Fuck, man. I can't believe this is gluten free. I can't believe the well, biscuits well, are. It had gluten in it. <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. I've been gluten free for the past 24 hours. Nice, really? bro. Okay. Because you haven't eaten in 24 hours? No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's like, I'm Are you actually going gluten free? I, I'm. You're fucking. Try, I'm, I'm trying to. You're fucking lie. You're fucking lying. Are you gonna start drinking like vodka exclusively? I <laughs> had vodka and fucking lemonade last they night. They do have fucking Tito's all <laughs> up in their shit. Vodka's good, man. You're gonna love it, bro. No, the gluten free pasta, no fucking different. Gluten free mac and cheese, no different. Really, dude? The, I, you were one. I'm gonna say it's like the third time I've said this, but the gluten free Oreos are hey, way better. By the way, uh, I want to take this time in the podcast to mention to you guys. I did get a sponsor. A sponsor? Uh, or said beef for my, for my AA, my AA meeting. I got a sponsor. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> okay. I'm Good. Just no. <laughs> He's, He's like, yeah, me and him go drinking. I'm David like, is <laughs> David is now 17 days sober. Yep. 
Uh, actually, technically not. Probably like sixteen because it vacation count. Lo- looped over vacation a day. Went into September. It doesn't I think I'd count. Like as to point out, y'all were ripping up uh, flooring. Weren't y'all drinking? <laughs> hey, I, I, hey, some I of us were. He was I not. Have beer for all the people helping me. But no, he wasn't drinking. No, he wasn't drinking. He didn't partake. Dude, bro, this has been the hardest month of not drinking because there's been so many amazing opportunities, events, and things like flooring, that. Flooring, flooring. Mm-hmm. Uh, my buddy's in from out of town, and he's here for like the longest time period he's ever been here, which is like two weeks. Don't get a drink with him. Uh, last night we ran into an old buddy uh from school. You know, that's a time it's like, oh shoot, let's do some shots. Shit, it's been a long time. You know, nope, better than a nope. shot though. Huh? You know what's better than a shot, though? Friendly hand job. And it brings you closer. In the corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was about to say the same thing. (laughs) Yeah, yeah. There's actually a spot I had in mind for that where we were at, but, you know, can't do that if you're not drinking. I need a little bit of liquid courage in me to get... Kev, yeah, these are are two of my best friends down here. Dave, uh, Dajama and Chivy. Yeah. They're actually neighbors of mine. He's a fucking liar. (laughs) Um, uh, We call him uh, Shimmy. He's down the street. And Pajama is like... Pajama? Oh, pajama. not only that. Pajamas in my closet right now. So, pajama man. <laughs> pajama. Hey, and no, no. Follow me on my OnlyFans, Banana Man 99. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. I wouldn't put it past you to have that. He's like, this is a money-making opportunity if I've ever seen one. <laughs> Bro, all right, so we were talking about how, uh, speaking of money-making opportunities, how you don't have to have an OnlyFans. You can just sell feet pictures. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Is there a market for dude's feet? I'm sure. Probably. I don't yeah, know, but I feel the like hairier, I feel like the ca- more callous, the better. No, like no, no, no. It's definitely other dudes into other dudes' feet. Oh, yeah, that yeah, makes yeah, more sense. That makes more sense. I was like, I don't think chicks are into feet like that. Yeah, no. I'm not into like, feet. And I'm a dude, but I don't understand that. There are some like fetishes. I'm like, I, I get it. Feet. No, I don't understand feet, man. I don't understand feet. And don't get like, it. They'll, they'll like they'll fuck the foot. I know. Oh, I know. They'll put them together. I'm like, you know what's a couple of feet above the foot. Like, all right, so yeah. here, here, here's my, my theory always uh-huh. it was like uh There's a much uh, more efficient way to do this. <laughs> feet by the foot. Why it took me so long in life to ever try uh knocking on the back door. Yeah. Because I was always like, you know who the neighbor is to the back door? Why would I go in your back door? You know who the neighbor is? Mm, love that motherfucker. Why would I ever try and go in the other one? It took me, I was fucking way older than I should have been to try it. I remember one of the first times I tried it. This is this is how I knew she was a whore. Uh, listen, <laughs> I know I'm not even joking. This 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 is how it happened. She's on top, and you know the, the rhythm. Okay, she's 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 giving a ride, right? She's getting a ride on, and we're just like, this is great. And without missing a fucking beat, whoop, it was switch, a switch and change up, rearrange. Like, did that? It's just like yeah. Did so she even, even notice? Like, went did she up care? a little bit. You didn't. No, she did it on purpose. She did it. Didn't even yeah, need an no adjustment wins. period, huh? Without no missing stride, she goes bloop, and and I'm like, you didn't. I was like, yeah, she's that? like, she's like, did something? Yep. Or you're like, you're like, did something change? She's like, nope, keep going. She <laughs> didn't flinch or like, oh, oh ow. She, it was like bloop, 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 and didn't miss a beat. And I was like, and then it went blah, 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 blah. You're a whore. There's no way you're not a whore. There's no. And then find out she had sex with a very close uh friend of mine, and then everybody else. So I was right. She was a whore. She was a whore. But he I, said, I didn't know. and then Squazzy had to take two pills. Bro, she <laughs> she did it without, and her eye didn't do this. <laughs> there was no like that hurt a little bit. It just went in like it. I was like, my is butt. that in your? She was like, uh huh. And I was like, no, nah, no fucking uh, uh, sobs and creams in my future. I'm gonna put <laughs> not happening. So yeah, um, rashes, lots and, and I, lots you know, of rashes. And people are into what they're into, but I still don't. I still prefer the regular door. Yeah. yeah. Before kicking in the front door, you know what I mean, and spreading it out as best as I'm able to, <laughs> <laughs> supporting the walls, if you know what I mean, as, as best as I'm able to, as best I'm able with my little door knockers slapping against her back door. <laughs> <laughs> What's that old saying? If there's no grass on the field, flip her over and play in the mud. Oh God, <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've heard that. But that's all, but that's also a stigma these days. Most females are like, oh, I don't have any any hair because it's it's gross. Listen. I can tell you, listen, I will tell, uh, just grow it for a little bit. Just grow it for a little bit. No, dude, no, literally, so, uh, like, hair. I like hair and not hair, but I like hair, too. Well, hair is a, it's a function. 
yeah. on the body. It's right. designed to keep things from falling in there. Mm -hmm. Like armpit hair is a net, is like yeah, it's supposed to be a thing. You know, I looked up why people have eyebrows. To keep probably yeah, to keep uh, the sweat right, so off, off your eyes, or or that's also to it's that's one of the functions. Another one is uh, is actually to help with uh, with sun. You know how football yeah. players put black right here. Yeah. To help block like block out the sun. Right. Yeah, or like it, it like creates like a helps do that or whatever. It and that's why you see people who are live in more arid climates. Have real thick ass bushy eyebrows. I thought it was when I was eating rash. It keeps the pussy scent right there for the rest of the day. But I'm wrong. <laughs> no, that's that's what a mustache. Yes, Kevy, yeah. plug your ears, young <laughs> one. I was wrong. I was wrong. Hey, uh, this, this, this channel's for adults. We're on YouTube. We're on YouTube. We're good. <laughs> <laughs> and YouTube bam. <laughs> and they're gone. There, you're out of here. Hair gets a stigma, right? And it it shouldn't. You you should listen. Just try it. If your lady is 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 bone bare, right? Tell her go one month. Don't even trim it. Don't do nothing. Mm. Enjoy that for a session or two, and then tell her, go tr trim it up. What you go just ahead. did was you had some stranger without having a stranger. <laughs> I don't think it changes it that much. Oh, it does. It does. If you if you let her just go full fucking yeah. You let her go full fucking gargonzola cheese. Gargonzola. Just let, just, just let her, you know, let her grow the mold. Gargonzola. Um, let her grow the mold. Right? Oh, speaking of that. So I was, I, gotta... I was 18 years old, and there was this chick that I was like, yo, there's two things about this chick is wild. Speaking of gorgonzola and mold. Um, so we go to her house. This is the first time I've, I've, in my life. It's probably one of the only times in my life that I've ever, like, said, oh, oh, no, no. I'm going to, I got to go. And I left. I... I get this chick to her house. We're at her house. She had a badass fucking Camaro. Yo, this thing was fucking quick, man. And everybody was like, yo, what does she do for a living? But we figured it out. I <laughs> figured it out. <laughs> so we get her to the house. Boom, bang. I get her pulling down the panties. We're laying in her bed. Pull down the panties and thick hair. Like, thick. And I, I didn't care. I'm, I'm down with hair, no hair, whatever. My problem was when I, we were 18 years old. I pulled down and poof, this hair popped up. And... I'm not joking. The the best way to describe it, and it sounds so foul, but the best way to describe it, I've described it that way my whole entire life, is the hair looked like it had just survived 9-11. It was that kind of dusty gray, and it, it looked so, like, not the, all of it. She's 18. All of it. That gray. Dusty gray. And it, I, it looked like I smacked it, and it would poof, dust. So when I pulled it down, the, the shock to my system, I was like, oh. I was like, oh, man. I got a jet. Like I, I fucking, I gotta go. And she was like, "What? Like what's, what's going on?" I was like, "No, nah, I got a jet." And I left. I talked nah. I talked myself into, in the, you know, all right, fucking just, you know, all right. So she's got some different looking hair. So get into it, man. So Squ hold on, hold on, hold on. He comes back. Squadzy, did you oh, just compare a woman's pub pubic hair to the nine eleven terrorist attacks? All right. So a better way to put it is, she looked like you dumped a vacuum out on her. You know, she was dusty. Is my point. You compared it to nine eleven. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. <laughs> Um, just a little bit. Hey, she wasn't getting this. <laughs> he said it looked like when the plane hit Tower 2. So, I hey, could jump we like, have, into going back at it, right? Could after, Jeff, you'll after, have melted that <laughs> <laughs> No, it would have stayed not melted. Um, me and a bunch of friends, and I was telling them about it, and they were like, bro, just hair hair got you not to smash? Jay, go back. I was like, you, you would smash that? You didn't see it, bro. You didn't, and back in the day, we had those flip phones that you couldn't even take a good picture of it because it would be so pixelated, like a Mario Brothers game. So I was like, all right, let's just, let's go. I'm going back. So I talk her into it. We get that's, in her car. That's the basement level. We get in her car. We're going to head to her house. And she's like, oh, I got to stop by AutoZone real quick. Get, get a the, can I'm of the, air duster. I'm the man. Shop back. I'm the man she's going to try and date. I'm the man that she's going to try and date. Hmm? We're going to stop by AutoZone real quick. And I was like, all right, bet, bet. So we pull in. Boom. She gets out. She's like, just stay here i was like no nah, go get what you gotta get her she always buys shit for her car buying shit so i'm chilling i see her go out the back of the auto zone behind the dumpster with the dude that works there and she would blow him free car parts oh my god comes walking back from the dumpster and she's got her car parked and she gets in and she's like hey babe <laughs> and she goes i get free car parts like it's no big deal <laughs> She she's like, I get free car parts, though. Like, look at this car. And I was like, the fuck you at? You, I was going to kiss you. 
Yeah. I was like, yo, take me back to my car. Take me back to my Chrysler little Baron. Take me back to my car. I hey, go. hey, here's a question though. What uh, was the car part that she got? What I didn't even. I didn't even. Was yeah. it like well, a fucking important. new alternator, or was it like a like a supercharger? It could have been a brand new turbo. I'm like, nah, you know, and we would have kissed, and I was gonna suffer through. Hey, that's more like tragedy a tragedy that we all remember. She got a turbo. She Not probably a offered. Turbo. She probably offered him sex, and he was like, nah. <laughs> He's like, we can work something you else can, out. You can blow me. <laughs> Yo, that I'm not joking. My mouth crazy is that that happened, and and I was like, just bring me back to my yeah. We're not gonna do this. I was like, I think I think we're good. She was like, Yo, you're not even being cool. I'm like, It's not about being cool. It's not about being cool. You just blew, you just blew the dude. She did. Like, she say, like Hey, were, like I'm gonna go blow this guy and get a nope, car part. Nope, dude. It sounds like you were being pretty cool to me. Like, hey, if, no, Dave, she, if Dave I, was in the situation, he would have just knocked her out and stolen her car. Yeah. <laughs> no, do you know what's car. funny? No, she. She's walking back from the, the back of the auto zone, passing the car, like from a distance. She looks you in the eye. She's like, <laughs> and it goes behind the dumpster. And you're like, what the fuck? I saw her walk back there with you. And I'm like, what the hell is she doing? And then when she came back, I was like, yo, hey, listen, real talk. What is going on? And she was like, nah, I, I, I was like, I was looking for car parts. And I was like, <clears throat> you know, yeah, we're, we're so talking we're here. You she's know, like, we're, no, no, she's like, chill, be cool. I'm like, <laughs> no. She's like, look at this car, yo. How do you think I got this hooked up? Like, relax. And I was like, mm-mm. Mm-mm. We didn't just do his taxes. We didn't just... <laughs> that's the that's kind of... only a one-time thing, though. Okay. That's the kind of thing where she, would, where she would be like, well, at least I don't suck dick for drugs. <laughs> <laughs> yo, you're so right. <laughs> I told everybody, everybody I hung out with, I was like, yo, listen. <clears throat> I know you'd suffer through it and just die. <clears throat> Listen, she's she's blowing people for car parts, and they were like, "Squazzy, oh, tell what? Tell your auto part. Tell Dave and Shiv your uh, story about that girlfriend who did things to be better for you." Oh shit! <laughs> so I'm chilling, right? And uh, we're in high school, and uh, <laughs> this, you know, this I've had things happen to me that like baffle you, right? So my friend walked up to me and he was like, yo, Jay, hey, let me holler at you real quick. It's before like the bell rings and everything. We're all just chilling, walking around the school. And uh, he's like, yo, your girl was at a party last night. I was like, okay. I was like, I'm not her father, bro. Like, you might think that's the kind of relationship. I was like, she can party all night long, bro. I'm not going to tell my lady you can't go to. He was like, well, just let me finish. He was like, she took like 12 dudes into one room when she blew them all. I go, fuck. He was like, don't kill the messenger. I was like, no, 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 I'm not mad at you. You told me. Like, it's he was like, yo, she blew them all. Here comes, here comes said lady. Chloe McGee. Right? I said, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You just gonna kiss me? You he gonna like, kiss me? <laughs> You're just gonna walk up and kiss me? You probably still got dick on your breath. Are you kidding me right now? She starts crying. She I'm I'm back. You're a jerk, Swazi. What are you crying for? You just tried to kiss me with 12 dongs still on your molars. What are you talking about? She's crying. And she says, <laughs> I'm not even joking. This this happened, and I wish it never did, because I'm sure I've kissed her <laughs> and didn't catch on, right? She's <laughs> well, I mean, you... practicing to get better for you. <laughs> I'm not joking. Out of her fucking mouth. I said, practicing, practice on me. What the hell do you mean? <laughs> She's crying like I'm an asshole. And trying to get all her little friends to be like, yo, she was doing that for you, bro. Yeah, yeah, dude, you overreacted. Come on, she man. Said, dude, she was trying to better herself. <laughs> I, was, I was practicing to get better for you. Yeah, who are you to restrict this young lady? <laughs> it seems pretty chivalrous to me on her yo, part. She's, I uh... was like dumb. My boy was like, please don't, please don't punch me. And I was like, no, I'm not mad at you at all. Like, yo, listen, I'm a, I, uh, you told me. He's like, he's like, he's like I, I was, was one of the 12. Nah, 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 nah. Like, I was number seven. I'm gonna, he's like, <laughs> I actually have it on video. I did have a, he's, he's like, like he's like, he's like, like I was, I was number two and I was number 12 and she did get better. I had a close homie that actually, I had a homie that actually slept with her. And then we did the, uh, the streaking day where 50 of us got naked at the beach. Yeah. 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 And he got a nickname, and I don't care that he slept with her now. I'm like, <laughs> in high school, your nickname was Merger has a small pecker. So 
you enjoy that, buddy. Like, that's how all the girls talked about him. For So, yeah, he slept, he slept with her. We're not together anymore. She's a monster whore. We're not together anymore. But you'll never outlive that nickname. When we have a high school reunion, when I see that dude, I'm just going to be like, hey, my thing has a small pack. What's up, dude? How you been? <coughs> Good? Never get any bigger? Say when. Say when. I love that you're pretending that you didn't say this guy's name last time. Last <laughs> yeah. week, when I, said, I, like, said everybody I think you did because you said he was a. <laughs> you had said he was a dick, and, and you had no problem saying you're his like, name because yeah, you're, you're like, not friends anymore or something like that. that. All right, Mark Becker has a small pecker. What's that? Listen, I'm just. I, I know I said it, yo. But uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So fuck him. <laughs> fuck him. And uh, we could borrow uh, the Jama's ruler in the, in the reunion. I'm gonna be like, hey, bro. It's always on hand. And it's orange. Here, you it's live orange. in this region. Most of us live up here. Some of us <laughs> that are growers, they live up here. Jeez. Some of us live up here. Yeah. So, all right, speaking of rulers, we've all done it, yeah? Yeah. We've all done measured, it. Right? Not so, for a long time. So I found out, I, yo, I'm great at, like, tricking people into thinking I'm gigantic, right? If you were watching last week, if you missed last week's episode, catch up. Go watch last week's after this week's episode. So it comes ruler time, and we got those old old phones, the the, the these phones, the flippy ups with the, yeah. you know, the two megapixel the cameras. Flippy ups. The flippy right. ups. The 16 bit cameras. So everybody's, you know, all these girls, all their boyfriends are sending them a picture of them rulering. My lady's like, yo, send me one. And I was like, nah, I don't really do that. So no, send me one. And I was like, all right. So all these dudes sent their girlfriends precise measurement pictures. Fucking idiots. Mm. Fucking idiots. Idiots. You fucking idiots. Not I take so the ruler cool. and she showed all of her friends. I take the ruler and I put it underneath because there's way more push room. <laughs> Not on top with a precise measurement. Underneath, mm -hmm. way more push room. No, that's I precise. That's the precise measurement. Man. And she showed all of her friends. And all of her friends were like, no fucking shit. And I was like, gentlemen, we got to talk, yo. Y'all took precise measurements and sent those out? How do you not go underneath and just push your balls? Push your balls out of the way. You're the man, and you're showing her on a ruler. This is on a ruler. And it's also about, about perspective. So if you bring no, the camera bro. back some, then on the measurement. No, you like did it wrong, bro. What you should do, what you should have done is got one of those little green, like, army men toys. I put it next. <laughs> no, and put, it in the, put it in the background. This is my friend Hank. In the background, in the background bro. Create that away. depth perception trick. Yeah. So whenever you can't, like, He's not gonna question like, why Hank has a gun. You've got the girth and the leg. Why is Hank holding a gun? So there's actually a. I'm gonna use the boxes. There's actually a trick when you when you catch a fish up, Tyler? of how you take the picture. You you lift the bass right, and you hold it like this in front of yes, you. Yes, yes. Oh no! Listen, you don't have to do that anymore, gentlemen. Oh, wait, there's apps. There's apps. Dick, bigger you dick apps. These? Okay. Yeah, you just uh. One of them. One of them. No, no. no. Uh, you guys, listen. It's easy. Do it with. Do it with your microphone right now. If you have three cameras, put it on ultra wide and just go right here. I'm on poor. Ultra, I got two cameras. On ultra wide. You're... Ultra. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Say it again. I don't. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. Yo, hey, hey, y'all see how big <laughs> the microphone is? Ultra wide. Whoa! <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that's David's funny. over here taking notes, never send, bro. Never send something that's not ultra wide ever again to your lady. Ultra wide that thing, and she's like, "Damn, you know that's we all, live together, that's right?" That's ultra wide. <laughs> yeah. I, I seen your we're tiny married. Fucking shrimp walks to the bathroom this morning to take a pee. Like, what are you fooling, son? It still looks bad. I mean, you got to be cinematic about it. You know, there's no reason to not be. So I try and always keep my my briefs on because I went through a time period where I didn't have my briefs on and I was just naked all the time at the house, right? All the time, I was just naked. And then I realized no more, no more frill, no more pumping, you know, no, no more. Oh, there's a pee pee. Cause it was always a pee pee. There was no, right? So put the briefs on for a couple months. And then when you go, Hey, check this out. She's like, no, ma, I was gonna, I'll call you back. <laughs> Before she was like, oh, that's cute. I mean, <laughs> She always sees pee pee. <laughs> Don't always show the pee pee. That's my thing, because shock value. Now, now it doesn't work the same for men and women. She could always be naked all the time, all the time, and, and I could be. Ooh, boobies! Game, if I see boob, boobies, 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 booty, 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 right? It doesn't booty, work the same booty. for men. At a certain Ooh, point, they, they, you walk by and they're just like, they're they're numb to it. They get numb. So put your briefs on, boys. 
Uh, briefs, all of us, yes? Uh, yeah. 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 No boxers? Trav's like, no, y'all wear thongs. Just me. Just, <laughs> just me. No, nah, I'm a boxer. I'm a boxer it's like briefs it's thong guy. Thursday. <laughs> it's thong Thursday. All right, so let's let's uh let's get a little bit into uh. Would you rather? And you have to freaking answer. That's what it's called. Would you rather? Let. Now I figure we have some good ones, but this is episode two, so we're gonna revisit some from the past when we used to do the show. Yeah, we're okay. gonna see what. Dajama and Shiv would would go with, and I mentioned it in the first episode, and I'm curious. <laughs> would you rather? And chat, everybody's chat. Feel free to participate as soon as I say this out. Put it in chat. What you would do? Would you rather have sex with your mother with your uh. wife's brain, or your wife with your mother's brain? Meaning your mom's body, but your lady's brain in it, or? Your wife they, David your does uh, newly have a girlfriend now too, so he can actually. Let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. And that's the only way to switch when, them back. When they're switched back, do they remember? Yes. Everything. Ah. Uh, so right. Wait, so you're wait, either does... doing mom because it, it's your lady, and your mother will never know how you feel, and they don't switch during because that would be like, hey ma, yeah, when you're done, and it's over. Kev said, "I'm 15. I can't answer. Sorry." <laughs> <laughs> So uh, you'd, you'd never forget your mother's body, but she'd never remember you and how you feel. Or you're in your wife's body, but your mother will always remember you're not a passionate or caring lover. My mom has, like, the worst memory ever, so I would take that one. Because she, she would forget immediately. She would and never. I'd be like, shut up, mom, no talking. <laughs> you'd never forget that. She'd be like, "Why do you dog leg left? It looks like a roach oh, leg." That's that's a horrible <laughs> question. I hate this. I remember. I believe I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with my previous answer. It's gonna be my fiance with the head buried in the pillow. That's and what I. That's literally what I was thinking. That's what I'm going with. Your too. mom. We're your just mom, gonna. We're gonna get this over with quick. Your mom's <laughs> never gonna forget that. Like your your mom's fine. gonna be at dinner and you're gonna go to pass her here the salt. She's gonna go. <sighs> <sighs> Or, or even worse, there. she goes. Need a salt. <laughs> what? What if? What if she's at dinner? Fucked up. What, what if she's at dinner? And she's just like, no. Can we talk about? Hey, um. Listen, <laughs> listen, listen, listen. Brendan said, "I'm 21. I can't teach, answer." Teach, teach your father. Teach your father. You're like, what? Teach the thing you did. Teach your father. Oh, no, you need wow. to know. Wow. Right? It can get real weird. It can get real weird. No, this is the. But with the head in the wow. pillow thing, you can never <laughs> say your mom saw your O face. She's wiped your ass, right? She's cleaned shit off of your body. It doesn't she's matter. She's your schmeckle. It's a different thing. It's way different. She's never seen <laughs> my... She's never looked me in the eye as I've climaxed before. <laughs> so, I, I, I think I'm going to go with the same the same rationale. Yeah. Is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with my lady and her brain because she's older. She's got less time before she expires off this earth, less time to remember it. Yep. You have to live around. with that for a lot longer. Yeah. Yeah. I in have to addition, live with it there's that, that visual factor in your head that you're going to have to live with if it's the other way around. I you would just do I mean? this. If I was going to pick the my mom's body with my lady, yeah, yeah. I'll just do this. But you're never going to forget the way it feels. And this is not good. This is not good mental <clears throat> things to have in our head, dude. <clears throat> <laughs> right? Yeah. But if 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 you think about it, all natural birth males aren't virgins. <clears throat> Aren't what? Oh, because they've been inside. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I was a C-section, so. Jesus. Sorry. Jesus. It only yeah, does this in Zoom. You were a C-section? I, I bet you had the same size head as a baby. Probably. They pulled them out like, who, 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 what the? They, they. <laughs> just the dangling little legs. They, they, <laughs> they, they, they looked, they looked between my mom's legs and they said, there's they no up, way. By the head. Prep for surgery. <laughs> Fucking, yeah, like Shaq was in there palming me. She's growing a pumpkin inside of her, and it's just what got the little the roots hanging on her his, his body and leg. Oh, she, look, he's gonna go throw up. Just no, or 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 he's gonna be like, "Hey, ma, I want to try something." Oh God! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm picking uh, Lady Mom's brain. Trav, Lady Mom's brain. We're not in this. We're on Zoom call. Everyone, Lady Lady Mom's brain. I <laughs> go that route because you're just never gonna forget. Oh. 
and and what if there's a piece of you that's like it actually feels good you ah, therapy no. therapy no. <laughs> ah. i like that Tra- right I like there that travis would rather like he would rather kill himself to save other people but he would also rather his mom remember it than him he's got this <laughs> selfish it's the, selfish. Well, because remember in the last episode, you you were talking about I would always sacrifice myself for my family. We were talking about the <laughs> box, but he's like, yeah. I definitely am not banging my mom. That's not happening. I'm sorry. So she's gonna remember. You'll never catch me banging my mom. Mm-mm. Never. My mom will only remember for a month tops. <laughs> she just completely forget, forget a, about it. You got a month tops, Dick? I'm I'm at, they're meant to be for at least a year, bro. Like they're gonna remember stop that. Stick. He's got a, a month stop stick. stick. Top, so that's that's only for my mom. Regular month stop stick. Wait, no, yeah. and, then, and then he's going to be mad defensive because, like, she's going to be like, here, I put extra key. He's like, I didn't give you my best work. I didn't give you my best work. I knew it was you, though. I didn't mom, give you you're embarrassing me in front of my friends. <laughs> and, then, like, and, then, and then him, his mom and his lady are going to be like, it was quick, right? No, hey, 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 right? Did he do the, oh, uh, right, hey, 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 right? Month this stop, Nick, month stop. Up. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He always does this weird thing smell with it. his you eye. Smell it. Okay, Me? it's got an odor. It's got, it's, it's got an odor. Jesus. Let next one move on. Next! next one. Would you rather? <laughs> oh, shit, son. All right. Okay. Um, This is, <laughs> we gotta go, like, way toned down from there. All right. Would you accident? Would you rather accidentally send a nude to your dad? He said, "Tone it down from here." Or your lady's dad? And my I'm talking dad. full nude, schlong a dong to your dad or your lady's dad? My dad. My For dad. Sure, my my dad. dad. Probably my dad. I don't want my dad seeing my dick. I'm gonna go with my lady's dad. Really? My dad would be like, "That's my boy." <laughs> my dad would be like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. "No son of mine." <laughs> <laughs> No, and, dude, then, and then using the wide dad, lens. when my lady's dad sees it, I can go. See, at least I'm not hurting her. Here's the question: Your dad, your dad's you, seen your, uh, you know, like this, hasn't. not like that, I guess. Yeah, but but here's the question: Do you purposely like? Is it accidentally sending it to him, or you're like, yeah, you're planning <laughs> on sending it? So like, that's no, an accident. You, it's an accident. Like, you, you have a personal text message, specifically your personal text him. message with it. Yeah, it's like. Here, Did dad, chat answer the first question in anybody's chat? Uh, Brent, Brendan said he's 21, not allowed to answer. Yeah, I need answers. Are, are, Mom, Kevin said I'm still 15, I can't answer. And then also with this one, you're, you're accidentally sending a, a nude to your, your father or your lady's father? Chet. Oh, you did say accidentally, yeah, yeah. Lady's um, father, depending how long the relationship is, he's not going to take it to heart, you know what I mean? At the same time, it's like, oh, they these kids, you know, they've been together What forever. if he sends you one back and he's like, bigger? <laughs> it's a power move and as a father you gotta be like <clears throat> not gonna send me your dick come here hey, bigger son i'm bigger what's up um well then i just use the ultra wide cam yeah use the wide lens. done deal <laughs> I know those old, folk, old oh, folks no, you're ain't right. knowing you're how right. to do you're that right. you're right you're right, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> yo, look i'm gonna tell you i'm gonna give you yo her father's like i'm gonna send one back real quick well he's gonna accidentally send us a dick pic don't yo, do hey, it hey look 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 he don't know how to work technology. He's like, I got this motherfucker. How you like this, bitch? How big is that, to... bitch? <laughs> <laughs> the head's pretty big. That's pretty fucking good. <laughs> That should be your new profile pic right there, Squatsy. Yeah, yeah. Your new Twitch, oh. Twitch, uh, Twitch. whatever. Oh, Trying to figure hey, out this actually, camera thing out. Here's a picture out. of my dick. <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, Ghost, Ghost said, what face. if you choose your dad and he sends one back? Because my dad's got a sick sense of humor. He might just be like, hey, little motherfucker. Oh, uh, dude, I was just saying, does anybody else's dad send them pictures of their shit? No. My dad, dad does. It on Instagram though. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, both of y'all. Just like tools and tractors and all of the shit. Yeah. No, Maybe I mean a shit. shit. In a no, my dad like does. he'll send me one. It'll it'll right fucking away. look like a question mark. Nah, it don't work. <laughs> Your dad and you are mad close. <laughs> mad close, yo. That's I'm not even close to most of my homies like that. He's sending you pictures of his poop. Dude, he sends them to me and my brother-in-law. <laughs> Y'all yeah, get together and have a family dinner and eat corn. He's like, it's already in there. Look. In there. <laughs> no, no, 
<laughs> here's a here's a teaser for what's for tomorrow. <laughs> you should go talk to somebody about that. <laughs> Trav, oh. you should start sending him recordings of your farts. Just, just record your farts and send it to him. He'd find that hilarious. Hey, that's, yeah. <laughs> that's He'd start a, uh, flinging them back right back at you. Bro. I know what you're referring to, Shiv. You do? Podcast related. Have you watched it? Are you talking I've about? listened to it. Oh, yeah, what is it? Yeah, I listened to it. Fuckface it, podcast. Fuckface. Uh, I've never seen it. That's my shit. I never heard of it. It's that, good. It's Apple? good. Uh, that's on everything. Yeah. Right. Fuckface. I'll have to check it out. Fuckface podcast. Have you ever heard of uh, Achievement Hunter or Rooster, Rooster Teeth? Teeth? The guys who made Red really? vs. Blue. You never seen Red vs. Blue? I've seen Red vs. Uh, Blue, but. Yeah, it's the same company that made that, but. Uh, okay, okay. I, I've never seen Red vs. Blue. I am surprised. It's good. What is it? Is it a cartoon? Is it? It's a like a machinimation with Halo that started like twelve. It's like they literally do that. like acting. They they have a story they're telling, but they yeah, do so it they filming in, the, in the game. Games. Yeah, in the old Halos, they would use the like uh, game forge footage mode yeah. to forge to mode. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yo, hey, Santana goes, Jay, you sent us the sound of you shitting. I mean, I I was it's, it was. Like, and then you know it's guy <laughs> toilet humor is what it guy is but yeah that, that, that's different than that. guy toilet humor is different like i'll set i'll send you a video of me and you're just here <laughs> all right guys have a good day that's guy to but to your dad bro what if what if you took a fucking hog of a shit like a world record type shit i've crossed the line of trip. comfortability and, sh and sent it to my lady I would just put it on. The wow! Screen. See, that's way more than that. Send she it to my like, dad. Who sends their lady pictures of their dookie? And I was like, me. Me. It was nice. It was like, yo, it was impressive, right? Wait, say when, right? It was fucking. <laughs> it was impressive, and she was and like, then you just make man. the caption like, I think we're gonna need a plumber. No, no, she like... was at work, and she opened it up in a meeting, and she was like, nobody <laughs> saw. But what if they did? Like, <laughs> she was like, she was like, that comes out of your butt, but I can't put one finger. <laughs> So, all right, it's funny. Speaking of that, speaking of that, what is your thoughts on? And I, I have my thoughts. See if they align with you. I'm ter I'm terrified. So, are we going into the when you, thing now? When, when you have a girlfriend, no, just a, just a quick little sidebar. When you have a girlfriend, you have your boundaries sexually, right? Yeah. She has hers, you have yours. Yeah. When you get married, I feel <clears throat> like you shouldn't have boundaries for your wife. Because if she has a fantasy, you should fulfill it within reason. I don't mean like, hey, let's bring 13. All right, well, then and hold on, hold on, hold on, that. hold on, hold on, hold on. You can't say within reason if you say no boundaries. Well, yeah, yeah, no, no, no boundaries. Unless it's like, within I want to fuck you off of a cliff, and then you fall. And then and like, you're dead. But, but you have a but backpack a, on, maybe, but, and you But that's a boundary. Maybe... But that's a boundary, right? You don't, you don't want Yeah, that's a boundary. Uh, another boundary oh. would be you don't want 13 dudes to come into the bedroom with y'all. Like, all right, let's be within reason. I mean, like, if your lady wants to put a digit inside you, as her husband, you got to be like, okay, go ahead. If she's always wanted to do or, or she wants to, she wants to, she wants to give it up. You got, you have to, as her husband, be like, that's your fantasy. I would you be like, to do that. Let me right. spend a couple hours in the bathroom getting this. Oh, thing no, no, it's, it's your job proper. to find a to, to find a lady who doesn't. He want said, to do "Let that. me get a couple I gallons of bleach." Want to do that. Yeah, I need right? some it's bleach. Your job. I need a scrubber of some sort. No, 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 no. You you go in the opposite direction. I want to make yeah. it stinky and as unpleasant as possible. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so she never wants to do it again. Yeah. I'm not gonna present it as a gem where she's like, "That wasn't even that bad." I kind of liked it. No, I'm gonna present it as Oscar the Grouch coming out of my asshole. Well, I'm going to try my hardest to get the biggest hemorrhoid before she does that. Uh, I don't want her to have to flick past grapes. Oh, oh my god. god. I don't want her to be comfortable. Hey, but honestly, that. the only so, bad part about it would be you thinking that that shit's nasty down there and what she experiencing. If it's a gym, it probably feels good as fuck. So I we have a buddy. I have a buddy who is into that shit and he I talks about it. Openly. <laughs> so, who who are we talking about? Uh, I'll just name names. I'll drop names. I don't give a fuck. Our buddy Mike Ross. Mike Ooh, Ross. He likes to name. get his ass licked. He does, and he does on a regular basis. He's gonna see this on Facebook. Yeah. <laughs> Personally, He's talked it, about it, it openly. It's not so. my thing, but I don't know. Right. So uh, where I would say, kind of well, what I would say though is like you don't know uh, is. One person's pain versus another person's pleasure. I grew up where pain was pleasure. 
<laughs> not even joking. No, I mean, okay, so I get that. But I'm saying, I'm saying, though. Me and suck blood out of my body. I still have scars. I grew up, pain was pleasure. Okay, but what I'm saying is, is like, there's limits, I think, that have to be. Like, I wouldn't expect, if you're into that, but your wife wasn't, you, you, right. you can't expect her to, right. no. to be, you know, physically harmed. But I view it differently. It's crazy, but I view it differently for the lady versus the male. Uh, you you're a man. Say. Take the pain, bro. A lady? No, you're never gonna do that. You have to be it respectful. Just depends, of the lady. Man. Like, you know I'm, what I mean? But how do, how do you know you don't like it? What if what if what if she unlocks Pandora's box? Right? What if what if this happens? What if you're like, <clears throat> just hold on, just let me. And she goes boop, and you go yes. What if the second she hit that button? The gates of heaven would... open in front of you. <laughs> well, I mean, okay, so yeah, but the, that's why you, that's why they do the whole thing with like safe words and shit. Like, oh yeah, my safe word. It's dude, you have that Agamemnon. Agamemnon. <laughs> I want her. To... Agamemnon. Aggie, Aggie, Aggie. It's, uh, say it. Say the whole thing. You're fucking up. Yeah. <laughs> Agamemnon. That's the whole thing. And then she stuffs a sock in your mouth, and you're like, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what? Safe words are the best way to do it. Safe words are the best way to do it. Who would let their girlfriend or wife peg them is what Brendan, I think Brendan thinks you're basically asking. No, it's not. Well, I mean, yeah, if, if that was her deepest desire, <laughs> if that was her deepest desire, you kind of have an obligation to be like, if you don't do it with me, you're going to do it with somebody else, right? Well, I mean, not, not if you're married, hopefully. Bro, I'm on, I'm on number two. And I can tell you, <laughs> I can tell you one thing. I got a shit, man. I got a shit. Go for it. Shit. All, all I mean, not that bad. It's, it comes and goes. But at, right now. If you got to go, you, you're good. Nah, 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 nah. He's going to run to the bathroom and be like, Bloop. he's going to come back. He's like, I've done research. It's not that bad. It's not. <laughs> it's actually. Not I agree. We, yeah, I agree. He takes, agree. A, he takes, a, picture a, he takes a picture of a shit with the wide lens. <laughs> His ruler's got an inch of shit on it. I'm going to take the ruler with me. <laughs> Brendan said, what obligation is there? I don't remember this in my right. vows. <laughs> what up, Anna? Anna in the building. Uh, Anna says, depends if consent is on the line. No, no, it has to be consent. Both oh, ways. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It has to be consensual both ways, Anna. Um, <coughs> do a lot, and she doesn't really care anymore. Each person is mentally different. That is true, but we're speaking in terms of, like, consent on both sides. Yeah. Nothing's done without consent. But I'm saying if, if she consents and you consent, and she wants to give it a little a little licky lick. But you did say I, something I, I about like, it. you said something about being married. Was. You said something about being married and being obligated to. Well, no, I, I mean like the mentality. In yeah, Obligation in, in the head. mentality of, of not, not in hers. It's different with hers. Squadzy, I mean, Squadzy misunderstood the vows. He said, when it said in sickness and in health. <laughs> I'm not like, hey, get on my chest, cut and bleed on me. Um, what, I, what I'm saying is like, <laughs> In your mind, you have to at least, as as the man, at least I perceive it that way. If my lady, like, oh, I really want to lick it, all right, cool. Like, all right, you're 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 not gonna enjoy this. Oh, please, Lord, don't let her enjoy this. Because what if she does and she's like, that was fucking amazing. I'm like, fuck, oh, man, now I gotta. What if, what if, what if, what if, but what if you enjoyed it? Like then you I said. enjoy it, and I'm not. Yo, listen, I don't kink shame at all. If I, then yo, you're I, you're glad that you tried it. Then I guess. What if it? I enjoyed it and she hated it? I'm gonna be like, that's what I was about to say. You yeah, doing yeah, yeah. Put some hot sauce on it. You doing that again? <laughs> because listen, you know that little, you know that flavored popcorn stuff. Sprinkle a little bit on there. The reality Put is, a death knot in there. You don't know if you enjoy God, it. You've never, never had it done, right? So, what if, what if? Here, here's how I can tell you. I know <laughs> I don't enjoy the finger. Is I, I've had uh, when I was fucking 20 years old. I had prostate issues, and they thought it was cancer. So obviously, I have to prostate check you. I was with my first wife at the time. How long ago was this? Didn't go. <laughs> so, almost. So, yeah. So, we're in we're in the hospital, and I'm 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 fucking I'm dying in pain. I'm hurting. I'm I'm really in fucking pain. They're like they, they threw the c word out. So now I'm panicking in pain, and they're trying to figure out what the fuck is going on with this young guy. This this very sexy young guy. So they're trying to figure it out. Listen, he's the doctor. I let him have his opinion. So, he's like, well, he's like, he's like. I trust put, his medical opinion. He's like, he, put, he is like, I want to ask you permission, but can I put two fingers up there instead of one? I think it's whoa, whoa, necessary. Whoa, 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 well, watch, watch three. This dude goes the doctor, and this dude that sounds horrible. Well, this guy I met at a bar, Frank, was like, I'll examine you. 
No, this, this doctor. I'm, <laughs> I, I'm not on, sure where he got his medical license, but so I'm, I'm on the bed, right? And he goes, "Just uh, you know, drop your pants, roll over, and uh, I'll do the exam." So I'm I'm on my side. He's behind me. I don't see him, but I see my lady. She's on the chair, and he goes, "She died." Do you want her out for this? And she was like, "Uh, uh-uh. uh." She, she was like, "Nope," because we are. I. Because, all right, so she was like, <coughs> so I was like, nah, she can stay. I don't really don't give a fuck. Just figure out why I'm in so much fucking pain, man. I, I'm not joking. And this dude had the thickness of this guy's fingers. It looked like your sure <laughs> yeah. microphone right there. Dick fingers. So I didn't know any of this had went on. Are you sure it was his finger then? Until Maybe not. <laughs> I, I didn't know until the exam was over and me and my lady are talking about it. And she was like, wow, this shit happened. And I was like, why, why, why? Besides dick, what had just dick. happened, what happened? Your dick got hard. And she goes, he's getting ready to examine, and he globs the giantest glob of lube onto his finger. And it Thank God. Bloop, onto the floor, and he looked at me for confirmation to go in dry. Uh, I go, no fucking way. She goes, blop, right onto the floor. Like, didn't touch his, onto the floor. And he looked over at me like, and she said, and he reapplied the lube. But he was looking at me for confirmation to go in dry. I was like, yo, if he'd have went in dry, I would have pinched and twist and snapped his fucking finger off. I'm like, no fucking way. She's like, swear to God, it hit the floor. And he looked at me going Dude, in. You know what I think? I think it wasn't for confirmation to go in dry. It was, he was, if she wasn't in there, he would have picked it up off the floor with his finger <laughs> and fucking went he'd in. Have been, he'd have been, he he's, 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 he's like, time. lube's yeah. really expensive he's these days. Her, he's like, shit, I guess I better use a different one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, That's yeah. That's what happened. I, yeah. I made a sound I've never, like, <laughs> <laughs> God. You're done. And he goes, Oh, yeah, it's definitely not good. Not good. And I was like, It's not good. It's not good. <laughs> he's like, I'm going to have to go in with the clamps. <laughs> so he's like, Man, at your age, it shouldn't be like inflamed. Like, this is, we got to really do some fucking, some exams. And I was like, This is fucking great. So, three different doctors I've had, you know, trying to figure it out. Um, One doctor, one doctor did it. And after he was done with the exam, he lit a cigarette. He kept saying, He kept saying, I'm so sorry. <laughs> he said, "You can." Play. I'm so sorry. I'm so, I'm sorry. He said, "I'm so sorry so much." I was fucking. Re- I was so uncomfortable. I was like, I was expecting him to leave and the doctor to walk in. I was like, "It's okay. It's, you know, it's okay. What's going on with me? Why am I in so much?" Oh, I'm so sorry again. I was like, "Bro," he said, "I'm sorry." No joke. Twenty five times before I left the room. And I was so fucking uncomfortable. He just didn't have like he was uncomfortable doing it. He didn't have a like, bedside manner. It was his first time. It might have been because he was very apologetic to the point where I was uncomfortable. And I was like, I was expecting him to pick up the broom and be like, doctor will be in in a minute. <laughs> He'd be like, holy shit. He popped your cherry and his. It's like an impractical joker. So they're like, all right, now stick your finger up his, ba- up his ass. And, and then I had a, I had, I had a, I've had two situations where this has happened. One, I had, I had uh, the physical exam, the, the grab the balls and cough. I had a lady, and this is how this professional said it. She's sitting down. She goes, drop your pants and walk towards my face. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. And then the other, the other lady I had, a, the, my, my third exam was a female. And she was talking about how she's divorcing her husband. And she's, you know, she's, she's ready to get back on the, the pony, essentially. Ready to get back out there and just start, you know, trying things and having some fun with some men. You about well, to do my exam. Can we not can we not talk about any of that shit? Just be professional as fuck right now. I'm uncomfortable as shit. I'm embarrassed because I'm showing the shrimp. I'm I'm obviously I'm scared. So it ain't like, it ain't woke up. He's he's sharp hay face right now. He's all the way back inside and he doesn't want to come out. It's not good. So I'm already embarrassed. And she's talking about how she's trying to like, you know, get back out there and like meet with some men and have some fun. And I'm like, I'm bent over the table at the point. I'm bent over. I'm just like, fuck this bitch. Just, just, just test me and leave, man. I'm uncomfortable. You didn't, and, and it had been roles reversed and it been a dude for and a female patient. He'd be in some trouble. She should have yeah, been That sounds like the start of a porno, honestly. Yeah, yeah it yeah. does kind of sound it, like it. it she was was he said it was not. It was not. <laughs> so, Are you so, feeling uncomfortable? He said, so I never got any royalty no. checks. So check it. They all she talk class, class action stuff. lawsuit. They all talk cancer, right? They, they all talk cancer. They're all talking crazy stuff, and I'm scared shitless. My lady one day goes, so I've been researching. Nobody can figure out what's wrong with you. They can't get a, 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 a proper fucking scope on, like, why you're in so much pain. She's like, drink silver water. I was like, what? The fuck? I was like, didn't that turn that dude blue? Because this dude drank so much silver, it turned his skin blue like pop. I, I heard about that. And he keeps doing it because it helps him. I take a spoon. She, she buys colloidal silver, 
Now I've been paying for years of of pain nobody can explain. <sighs> like scientists are baffled. I take a spoonful of fucking colloidal silver that day. I'm like, I feel fucking amazing. And this is not a, uh, I'm not a doctor, so <clears throat> do your own fucking research. I was like, the pain's gone. The pain's gone. Get the fuck out of here. The pain's gone. I'm like, yo, it's been years of them dropping the C word and doing tests and trying to figure out. They couldn't, like, everybody's like, I don't know. I'm like, you're the fucking professionals. Figure it out, man. <clears throat> I'm tired of fucking sausage things trying to feel around in there for a problem. Just figure it the fuck out. They scoped me. They're like, man, something's definitely going on. I'm like, but silver water. Whenever I'm in oh. pain, silver water, no pain. Cure is it, huh? Because um, back in the day, silver was what they used for, it's like an antibiotic. It clears out whatever's bad in your body. Don't drink too much, you'll turn blue, but works for me. Um, some mercury. That's like the speaking thing. of, like, medical malpractice and whatnot. Yeah, medical malpractice it definitely was, bro. Uh, have you seen, I think I might have talked about this before, I can't remember, but the uh, documentary on Netflix called Our Father. Uh-uh. I assume I know what this is about, but no. I'm uncomfortable where it's gone. <laughs> no, dude. So there was this fertility doctor in Indianapolis. You mean talking about Shiv? Yeah. David, do you remember yeah. me telling you about this? Yeah, tell the story. Tell so, it. So far now. This doctor in Indianapolis <clears throat> this is back in like the nineties probably is when it was like the you know, he's he's like older now. But um this motherfucker People would come in. I do know now. I do know for from for uh in like uh to be impregnated with you know donor semen insemination yeah artificial insemination and I guess they were I guess when it started they were having trouble getting donors to come in and donate sperm and so this motherfucker would go in the next room make his own donation into a cup yep. walk back into the next room. And put it into put it into these women. Yep. So far, I haven't. I need to check and see what the number is at now. He has like at the end of the documentary, he it was at ninety eight kids that yep. he had that that we they know about that they know about, and they they figured it all out through um, like ancestry twenty three and me. Mm -hmm. And there's these people that have you have ninety six mm -hmm. uh, siblings, and they're like, what? It has to be some kind of mistake. And no, come to find out, and the the woman that first discovered it and figured it all out, um, uh, she's like, every day I get up and I check my email because more and more people are doing the twenty three me testing every day. She's like, I'm gonna find. She, I dread the day that I see that I have a new sibling because mm -hmm. I have to call them and tell them that you have ninety eight other siblings and blah 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 blah. And the fucked up part about it all, I I, I think. You, at first glance, it's like, okay, these women wanted kids. He didn't have the donors. And they're getting doctor sperm. Well, no, 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 hold on. It gets worse. Come to find out, this motherfucker is, like, involved in some kind of weird-ass cult thing. Oh, yeah. And it's some kind of thing called uh, Quiverful. Oh, I thought. <laughs> Happy in the first half, not going to lie. <laughs> and I guess it's like, the thing is, is like, okay, you got it. You're, um, you're... It's like a white supremacy type thing, oh. and your quiver's full of arrows, and you need to send out as many arrows as you can and spread your genes and race oh or whatever. God, so much worse. Yeah. That's what he was doing. Yeah, and yeah. the the even worse part of it, come to find out, he's got some horrible genetic disorder. Oh, that oh no! That over half of the kids have. And wow. what's even more fucked up is this was all within the Indiana Indianapolis area. I don't think so far they found it, but it's possible that two siblings could, by happens, meet, fall in love, get married, have incest children. And, you know, there's all kinds of horrid things that could happen from that. But hey, in how that many of these fuck, kids, How many of these kids now have swastika tattoos? That's my question. <laughs> did, that, did that pass on? Genetically, yeah. Who knows, <laughs> dude? Hey, that's like, like Genghis Khan. Genghis Khan did the same thing. So uh, entirely like breach of his oath, right? That was it's fucking horrible. Yeah. So so, what's, Genghis Khan's well, a Pokemon. I, I, I'm, I'm here's a above. here's another level of fucked up too dude, that, with the like, story. Him trying to do like the breeding of like his race is wild. okay. So there's two more parts that's fucked up. There. There is a law now that makes that illegal. It's it's uh, like it should be. 
it's like it's literally they're they're basically saying that he essentially raped these women. Yeah, I mean, no, but he he it, built uh, their his his code of their trust. They put their trust in this doctor right, to do blah right. blah blah, and um, he actually did it to his best friend, like one of their be- his friends. The wife came in because they were having trouble conceiving, and oh. put his own whatever in his like one of his good <sighs> friends' wives, and they didn't know till like fucking. Way after all this. So fucking wild. And then here's what's messed up. So there's no law against it. Oh, you just said there was. Now there is. But then there wasn't. Oh, yeah, yeah. And so the... No. He went to trial. And they only... Child support. He's broke now. (laughs) That'd be nice. (laughs) Uh, No, yeah, you sign sign papers saying that your donor... You can't go after the donor. A donor for child support. You chose to be... But, um, damn, that's fucking wild. So they, they were like, okay, this guy's obviously, everyone thinks this guy's a piece of shit. And this is before they found out about the whole white supremacy, quiverful. But they're like, we got to get him on something. And he lied, they got him on treason because he lied to the FBI and said that he only did it 10 times. Yet they've proven he's done it 96 times or whatever. Like and they had to they had to subpoena him to get his DNA and all this shit, um, because they couldn't like go through his trash. It'd be like illegal search and seizure type shit. But they uh, he lied to the FBI, said he did it, he only did it ten times, and they proved that he did it more than that. And this motherfucker got house arrest for ninety days and a five hundred dollars. That's it. Something wow. like that. It was house arrest he, for like a certain. Got his, man, I that he got is his license revoked as well. I agree. He should have to. Have he was. He was already actually by the time it all they figured it all out. Thirty That's years later, retired. he was retired and and all that. Oh fuck. <laughs> so so my 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 conspiracy theory brain immediately went fucking. Bing, right. Yeah. Me too. Um, is it a documentary just to make everybody want to do ancestry dot com to get their DNA out because the company just like ancestry dot com took all a bunch of people's DNA, hundreds and thousands of people's DNA, and then sold it to China. Well, the thing is, though, it was, it, it's... That actually happened. That's that a, would that's only be... Yeah. You would only need to do that. They sold is it to this, another government. Well, is if someone watches this documentary and says, we saw that doctor in, in 1996. Or, or just people that were watching it go, I want to do the ancestry and just see. Who never knows? But right. companies like that have all the rights you signed off to your DNA. And they can sell I want to be part of that group. You know what I mean? They, they, now, now, let's say they sold your DNA, which <laughs> actually happened. Google it. We they need to sold, get this doctor's the, number. The company that was taking all your DNA sold it to another country, not just to a, a facility, to a country your DNA got sold to. Yeah. Now, imagine that country. Let's <laughs> say they have a uh, right, lab. You're they saying they manufacture a chemical yeah. weapon that affects. Just for your DNA. Only Americans or whatever. You know what I mean? Like, Come on, bro. Like, I, I'm not doing. Listen, I, my father told me growing up, this is a true story. This is the reality of life. You just got to fucking be smart. My father said, when we were young, when you date a girl, you better look at her features. Look at her features real well. My father used to hitchhike the United States. And he would sleep with a girl in every state. I'm not saying it was right. I'm not saying it was right for him to do. But, I mean, he, was, he, was, he wasn't tricking him. He was just, he'd meet a girl at a bar, one night stand. They would have sex. And he, he told her, I'm a traveler. I'm, I'm not going to be here tomorrow. They knew that. They knew the game. What he did that was kind of wrong was he, he gave his friend's name, his friend's Life story, his friends, everything. So the girl, like his friend called if him one he, day, like, yo, this girl in Kentucky said that she's pregnant. I have like a child and like I've never been to Kentucky. And my dad's like, well, weird. 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 <laughs> my, father, my father said, you probably have siblings all over the United States, right? Just watch their features before you sleep with them, right? So is he lying? Was he joking? I don't know. But what I've always learned is when I date a girl, you look like family. You know you don't look like. Family. You know what I mean? You, I've seen yeah. couples where I'm like those two are brother and sister. <laughs> have you? Have you ever like? Um, so thank God I met my fiance first at the reunion <laughs> because she looks like her her brother. Her and her brother have the same nose. Like you know what I mean? They have similar facial. Oh, you're saying you're glad you met her first because you would have dated her brother. Well, like if I'd have met her brother first, then he introduced her to me. I'm like, nah, you look just like your brother. 
Like, you know yeah. what I mean? Like, but because I met her first, it wasn't like as big of a deal. Like, I, don't know I dated the girl once. I didn't see it. And one time my boy said, how are you? She, she looks identical to her father. And I'm sitting in the kitchen and I took her father and I just did. This. Oh my God. I covered his head. Like he had hair and I went, it was the same person. To a T, nothing was different. <laughs> just the hair. And I never noticed it until I did this. And I went, Ooh, oh, no. I got to go. Dad like, is the conclusion of this ride. <laughs> no, son. She looked so much like her father. I was like, boy. She walked up to the doctor or to the dad and was like, are you a prostate doctor? Dude, the whole, the whole, walk, the whole walk home, I was like, I'm straight. 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 Right? Like, that was just her dad with long hair. <laughs> like I didn't ever catch it. I never. I was. I was probably boob mesmerized. You know. Hey, that's yeah, like that. Go poop and... No. He, yeah. He said it. He said that, it. He said, yo, oh, hella logs. So that's like uh, with him. that glass break thing. When I remember that streamer we were talking about, and I pointed you out to the old shovel chin. What? Hold on. No. <laughs> and I just said, Squazzy, listen. Her father had a girl costume. <laughs> oh god it was just her dad the whole time dating me <laughs> it's a trick <laughs> you got trapped oh shit that's fucking great i had to go through the family tree to make sure we weren't related we weren't related <laughs> him and his wife that's fucking funny um i i, I was gonna ask we'll, we'll, we'll do it with just just the two of us when he gets back we'll get his answer um would you rather have d cup man boobies d cup man boobies or a two inch penis I do have D cup man boobies, so <laughs> I do have it. I do have a two inch penis, so <laughs> I call them oh, pecs, shit. but I call them pecs, but nah, they're they're man tits. Yeah, he's like, I got D cups. He's like, I got a two inch penis. So, uh, are you guys switching? Or would you Would you rather the opposite? Um, you know, no. I think I like my two inch penis. I got the I got the I got the worst of both worlds, man. I got D cups <laughs> and a two. <laughs> I'm going to say D-cup man boobies because for sure in the middle of sex, I'm sucking on my boobies. <laughs> well, and you can always have surgery to, re like, to no, reduce them. No, I want them. them. I want to keep them. I just, oh, yeah. I just, like, I just, I want to play with them. My I great aunt them. married her uncle. What? Ooh. Brendan said his great aunt married her uncle. That's a little. Oh, great aunt married her uncle. Holy crap, that's not good. That's weird. <laughs> Is it, like, on purpose? <laughs> Brendan, are you where are you from? He's from Wyoming. Really? They don't have anything to do that in Wyoming. It's not Kentucky. It's not Alabama. Yeah. Right? So, <laughs> all right. so are you sticking with the, the man boobs? Or are you, are you I guess I'm sticking with man boobs because that's the situation I'm living in. Chip? Two inch dick. I'm taking it. I'm keeping it. I mean, <laughs> there's Turtle. <laughs> we start talking about uh, in, uh, incest in Alabama. Turtle's like, hey. <laughs> Yo, know, Shiv goes, I do two inches. I gain an inch, is what you're saying? Yeah, I gain a whole inch. <laughs> I gain a whole inch. Like, and how it gets are we measuring it with the ruler? <laughs> Turtle said, not everyone here does that. I do, but not I'm everyone. Taking, I'm taking I'm double D kidding. boobs. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding, Turtle. I'm taking double D boobs, because maybe she wants to talk on them while we're making love. You know what I mean? Here, you have... Points. Sometimes it's about what she wants, you know? Right. And the then we have, like, like a boob fight this? in the middle of it. Like, your boob is my boobs, and we're just... We're boobing it. I'm, I'm the thing I like And you both get nipple rings, and they get caught, and you're like, ah! Or we link them together with clamps, <laughs> you know. And we just. But, hey, I, like I heard that's actually what they're doing for marriages boobs. now. I like the idea of you having double D man boobs with, but being skinny, just as skinny as you are everywhere else. Right. <laughs> you right. just have the man boobs. Right, how many? How many ladies have we seen with the slender bill but the double Ds? You, you can got... probably make that happen in today's day and age. Just I'd rock it. Too. I would a couple rock thousand it. bucks, and I would rock it. As long as I didn't lose feeling in my nips, I'd rock it. Yeah, you gotta have All right, I'm quoting a movie here, so I'm not saying anything bad. This is literally a direct, direct quote from a movie. Yep. Uh, when you, when, in Ted 2, have you guys seen Ted 2? Yes. Maybe when he's, uh, he's like going through his computer, he's like, oh my God, Johnny, there's so much porn. There's so much porn. He's like, oh my God, Johnny, she mails? He's like, <laughs> I was curious. It's chicks with dicks. And he's like, Johnny, there's no such thing as chicks with dicks. It's just guys with tits. <laughs> Yo, have you ever been on an adult site and then the suggested videos pop up and you're like, not even remotely into that. Why would you suggest that for me? I'm not even remotely into that. Two-inch I... penis. <laughs> 
<laughs> yes. <laughs> no, I gotta go. Oh god. <laughs> Swap out. Tag out. Tag out. Tag it out, yo. Tag it out. <clears throat> gonna go measure. Like I would gain an inch. Uh, an old inch. apostolic Lutheran said to say people end up marrying their third cousins. There's a certain distance out that you're. It, it's like it would be safe to have kids, right? Is it is like fourth cousins or something like that, or third cousins, maybe. Like you can, you could potentially have a child with your third cousin because we're all related. Life. We're all related. I mean, down the line, yeah. Yeah, but yeah, like far back. far if you're far enough apart in the genetic, like in the tree, like it wouldn't be, you wouldn't have like fucked up kids. That's right. The the problem is like with uh, like back in the day, the kings and queens they only bred. They were like their own kid. Yeah, they, they didn't want to bring in you know, outside non royal blood type shit. Three hundred hey. years later, you've got a child sanctuary. Hey, what's y'all guys' uh, favorite type of graph? I'm going to say pie chart. Bar. Pie chart? Pie chart. Bar chart's good. Pie chart's good. Pie chart's solid. You get a good visual of the I, difference in size. I really do like them dang pie charts. So what I'm about a Venn diagram? Venn diagram? I mean, they're good and... and they're they're all just visual representations that's, that's patients meme, of data. That's a meme chart, dude. That's a meme chart. Yeah, what? Like, what? A meme chart. Honest, I don't know what they're a made for jokes. Is. They're made for jokes. I don't know what a Venn diagram is. Venn Hold diagrams on. where, like, you have a circle here that's like this is oh, what another this circle and they does. mesh. Yeah, they do, and then you can have like the, four of them though. They do the Olympic rings? Yes. Okay. Yeah. 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 Oh my God! Turtle said, "I literally, as an EMT, had to take a couple to the hospital that got their love spot jewelry stuck together." Oh, that's pretty wild. It's pretty cool though. You get to see their love spots. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so the doctor walks in there with a fucking grinder. He's like, not in the way you would think, though. It was butt to butt. I thought you were going <laughs> to say he walks in there with a fucking heart on. Pie chart all day. <laughs> Pie chart all day. He's like, so we got? Are we doing this, guys? Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. I gotta. Okay, never mind. This never is mind. a professional thing. Oh, right, here, we, here, here we go. Here we go. We're gonna debating like animals. Ooh. Now there is no wrong answer. You're just gonna pick a side, right? Or here, here, here here's how it, here's how it goes. I'm going to say it, and then two of us will be on one side, and then two of us will be on the other side. Whether or not you agree with the side you end up on, you got to debate it like you believe in it. This is my favorite part we do. Makes hey, sense. let me, a quick question. Is everybody in the same spot? Uh, you're on, you're below me, Shivy, b beside you, and Swazi's in top left. You're below hey, that's me. that's not me. Pajama, you're below me. Trav's. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> blowing you, dude. Well, I mean, kind of. You turned around. Uh, <clears throat> Immediately, <laughs> 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 Shiv, I did this. <laughs> Is Shiv another same thought? Mama uh, broke him. Oh, God. No, I have Shiv below me. No. Uh, and then look up, open your mouth. And then, Trav, you below Squadzy. <laughs> I mean, am I making any money? Uh, I mean, that's that's between you guys. You guys have to figure out your, you know, your financials there in that situation. Right. Here we go. Uh, hey, it looks like you are low, uh, Squadzy there on a shirt. You got a little... Whoa, yeah, Squadzy. I got a little excited. Premature, excited. my guy. A little ex hey, nothing's premature if you meant it. Yeah. <laughs> a little excited. A little excited. So listen, we've been, we've been, uh, we've been, we've been butt sex and peen sizes the whole time. So let's just start with an easy debate. <laughs> right. uh, how about a G-rated uh, one so Kevy can answer? Pine pineapple on pizza. Yes or no? Trash. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm going to pick the people who say what. Fucking pineapple. You have to debate it. So we're going to make Trav and Dajama say yes on pizza. Pineapple is good. And then me and Shiv are going to say it doesn't belong on pizza. Oh, it's a perfect blend, the sweet and salty. Uh, I like the shape of it. It goes well with the circle pizza. <laughs> <laughs> sweet. I'm gonna say, uh, no. Sweet well, pineapple on wrong. salty with salty no. cheese. Oh. Hey, you, Shiv, we can't it, hear it, you. He's oh, not, no, he's not I'm muted. He's, he's, I was no, unmuted. I literally thought you were. No, I was muted. Now we can't hear you, Dave. Ah, it's because I got your ass, boy. You go to Italy. Shivy's like, pineapple pie. definitely belongs on pizza. They don't, even yeah. have, they don't even have pineapple in Italy to put on their pie. It doesn't belong on a pie. It, 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 are you making a fruit salad? What are we doing? Yeah, what, what other type of pizza has fruit on it? Pineapple okay. on no pizza. pizza is revolutionary, and there should be other <laughs> uh, types of foods that need to be incorporated in pizza as well. No. Just like 
Pickles. Pickles need to be on pizza. No, no, because no. Pineapples come in little chunks. Right. Those yeah, the chunks perfect... can get stuck in your throat and then you choke and die. Hey, so, listen, and listen, you listen. Kill people? Are you trying to kill people? With listen, people to die? Listen. Hey, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be real honest with you. This is real hard to debate for pineapple because I'm I feel strong about this. So uh, so here's my uh, me so uh, me too me too. So here's the thing no, me with too. <laughs> here's the thing about pineapple and pizza is that like what does it affect you if I want pineapple on my pizza? No, because it affects me because because if we're are we if, on my pizza. Well, so yeah. I'm saying though, like I want pineapple on my pizza. Me. You're 400 miles away from me. What does it affect you at all when I get pineapple? That's not the debate. The debate is pineapples on pizza. So it'd be my pizza. Pineapple goes on, and I don't want something with the texture of a fucking. So don't. So it. don't order it on my pizza. I won't because it doesn't belong on pizza. Thanks for making my argument. It doesn't no. belong on pizza. Okay, but some people love love it. The I don't care about those people. I care about my pizza. The only pizza that's worth eating is just double anchovies. Okay, we're gonna. Not- Should be like salty and salty. <laughs> <laughs> Double anchovies and jalapenos. It's a texture thing. It's a texture thing. When you when you eat that pizza, you're used to that cheese and that sauce. Then you got this lump of 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 basically fruit vomit on your pizza. It ruins the entire everything. It's it's fruit vomit on your pizza. No, you can't even put fall. it on half of the pizza because the juice seeps into the crust. The whole pizza. It ruins the, the pizza. pizza. Well, that well that's what yeah. I'm saying. Then yeah. don't yeah, order it. Win. It's you like I'm won. just gonna squeeze some win. semen on the crust. I, it, it's on the pizza. I know we win. It's Wait, like, no, dude, Squadzy, win. it's like Call of Duty, dude. You don't like hacks, don't use them. Hey, uh, All right, for stop. real, though, I'll okay. stop Squadzy, <laughs> Squadzy uh, do chat. you actually like pineapple pizza or not? Well, well, we, we have to let chat decide who won the debate. Oh, okay. we're, we're, debate. That's what we're doing. Turtles we're brings that. up a really good point. Tomatoes are fruit. You don't have a problem with tomato sauce on pizza. Uh, Ghost said pineapples don't belong on pizza. And Anna said pineapples. Uh, no, Brendan, tomatoes are actually fruit. Don't belong yeah, here's the thing with the debate. Here's the thing with the debate, though. Everybody in the chat is going to be biased Goggling. one way or another. No, Our debate's not, not going to convince them either way. We no, add no. Bias and just go off who debated better. Well, that's the point of this, David. Is that we're who debated better? And well, right now, I think your argument was if you don't like, don't eat. And our argument was the taste, the texture, the smell. Um, we went through the. All right, but can you choking, do this? And can and you do this? Can you do that? Can you do that? I can't even. You, can you do that? Kevy says yeah. pineapple does belong on pizza. <laughs> Turtle says pineapple yeah, belongs yeah, on pizza. All right, all right. Brendan, what do you think about pineapple on pizza? I can do that. You got it, but you got you didn't do it cool. You got to I've got to nope. be brutally honest. I fucking love pineapple on pizza. It is my favorite thing to I'm do. I'm pretty I sure the other best. three of us are all against you. I'm gonna be brutally honest. Me too. Fucking I pineapple fucking all love the pineapple, way. Dude. Honestly, it's pineapple. You, like, you said no at first. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely love pineapple on pizza because that's the side I'm on. Uh, listen here, anybody who, if you look at the people who are opposed to pineapple on pizza and you like do an IQ test on them, it's like ten, maybe, maybe that's fifteen. High. That's, that's, high. High. that's the mean. That's the average. That's the mean average of, of people who are completely against pineapple on yeah, pizza. Yeah, ten out of ten. Uh no no uh total like I heard I, they actually like, took a poll okay. too if you don't like pineapple on pizza you you have a tiny little baby peen yeah I saw that, I mean actually. or double D I did that study. we we did, did the study. <laughs> one of the two one of the two uh I think I think we we come up with more like logical reasons why chat obviously we come up with more uh Brendan why. said the only logical reason for pineapple to be on pizza is if it's in the trash can thank you. No, I seriously. That's what Brendan said. I'm just repeating what he's my favorite shit. It's it's only better with spicy too. I I've tried pineapple pizza my whole life and hated it until I had one pizza place actually make it right, and it was Dude, fucking delicious. If it's right, it's amazing. That's not ever what I want is hot fruit. <laughs> <laughs> it's true though. That's the one thing it's, I couldn't yeah. get past is my pineapple being hot. Well, it just you don't even like feel the texture of it. No, pineapple right. does not belong. Here's just, my, my honest opinion. opinion. My We've thing is, arguments all right, so pineapple sweet and s- sweet and hot or whatever the fuck we are sweet and was, salty. The cheese is salty. Way there could be way different things that could be a replacement for like pineapple. What? Like honey, what? Honey, honey, on honey, pizza? On pizza? honey on pizza, honey on pizza. Well, the first person it adds sweetness without the grossness of the pineapple. Pizza? Hot chunks. <laughs> have you ever Listen, had Cece's pizza, anybody? I have. Yeah. Cece's? Cece's pizza. Yeah. See, you go that to the restaurant, awesome. they're like, we have chocolate on this pizza. Yeah. Yeah. Macaroni and cheese oh. pizza. That's yeah, macaroni and cheese here, pizza. son. But no, they listen, have... listen. I'm just saying, pineapple 
can be replaced with something that's way fucking better than pineapple. Obviously, never put pineapple Blueberries probably like pizza. dropped cool. it. They had pineapple. It's going to be their dessert after they finish their pizza. They're like, oh shit, I dropped just it on the sugar. pizza. Just dump a bunch of sugar. I, on I it. am okay if you blended the pineapple up and put pineapple sauce. Ooh. Nah, you don't have the texture of the pineapple. I would like, uh, I would like, like remember we had this debate about Papa cheese. John's. How Papa John's puts like a bunch of sugar in their salt in their sauce. Yeah, but Papa John's gives you all of them. Pepperoncini. Do. Do. You could dip in the garlic. And then oh, I hate, I hate Papa John's, dude. I think their crust is no, dude, gross. Hey, Papa John's uh, in some trouble. They're no like, longer the official pizza of the NFL. Like Ooh. I, like I said, uh, Papa John's slogan should be "shitty ingredients, shitty pizza." No, no, sh shitty owner. Uh, pretty good pizza. Dude, are you kidding me? The owner is a fucking boss. He's no, a that's boss. a weird fucking dude, man. He's that's a cocaine. weird. Did something come out that I don't Yo, know about? What's up? No, he's just he's just as weird and awkward as like you ever seen Garth Brooks? Yes. The media. Oh, yes. Jesus, this guy has no clue how to not be awkward. Papa John, same way. They have, been too, it's been legal social media. <laughs> Uh, Garth Brooks has just been too famous for too long, and it's like I he's pretending he's been he's pretending to be a normal human. Well, the yep. joke about Garth Brooks is he's a mass murderer. Years. I can well, see he it. Acts like it. He acts Gaines. like it. Hey, he's Chris Gaines. Hey, but Chris hold Gaines. on, hold on. Does anybody know any other owner, like CEO, owner of any other pizza place? No. You guys know? Yeah. I mean, there's a gecko. No, that owns no I don't. That exactly. Company. Papa John. He made a name for himself and. Hey, who knows right, what didn't, kind of didn't didn't he say I don't want to like didn't he say some like horribly racist shit or something and they were like yo we gotta so. get this guy out of here yeah he said I the n word he said the n word with hard r uh, I don't know did he I Mel have Gibson no idea. I think it was literally like in a podcast or something like or an interview no, they tried to cancel uh, uh Joe the Rogan guy for saying it with an a and well so that, they tried it with Joe Rogan too because he said he Joe said Rogan. it multiple no, it times a with the it was hard a r Zoom call meeting I think actually. With Papa John guy. Oh yeah, I do think I think I think it was a call. I think yeah. it was a call. But there's just more publicity for him. No, but he had to give up. He had to give up his seat. He's no longer the CEO of. Oh, uh, and then he gave the up all of his of money. Papa John. So I've always been curious about that, David. You might actually know. So did he start Papa John's? No idea. No idea. Because like my thing is so like when a business gets so big, right? There ends up being a CEO. And like, there's no owner anymore. It's all stock owned by stockholders, right? Right. If they decide to, yeah. And like, I, I, I would, I kind of hate that because then now my business that I got to be big is now I can't make decisions about. You don't have to though. You can keep it a family owned business. Like I, I, I know one. What's that I, What's I the largest family owned business with that that's not like traded on the stock market? I know one that's over a billion dollar business, family owned. Who? What? Can't say it live. But, oh, is it? Oh, it's not like a well-known company. Uh, over a billion dollars doesn't have to be well-known, right? So it's not well-known. No, no. But like, I'm out, saying like, okay, state, actually, you know what? Out of the state, they know of it, but like in the normal, you guys wouldn't know. Okay. It. But what I'm saying is, I was like, but you can have a billion-dollar company and still keep it family-owned. No, I, I mean, I, I, no, I get that, but like, no, well, that's how you get investment money. You don't need it. Dude. You're over a billion-dollar company. You don't need it. Well, I mean, so, but, okay, that's what I'm saying. Name a nationwide company that's really well known that's not Bob Evans. My OnlyFans? Yeah, is Bob Evans, Evans my, my OnlyFans? Still, still owned? Uh, I think you can buy Bob yeah. Evans stock. I no, no I don't think you can. Bob Evans is not a publicly traded company. Really? And he I'm says that with, 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 he'll bet you a tattoo on his face. He? Well, David actually David. does stock trading, so he would know. He's Dang. the only one who would know. Oh, shit. I did Brent, yeah. Brendan I makes a crypto. Brendan makes a really good point. Uh, the yeah. a drug hey, lord, a cartel. Guys. Cartels are family owned. Oh yeah, yeah, that's good. Multi billion dollar companies, family Except owned. They're not they really just, family owned. It's right, we're, we're gonna get into we're gonna get into another one here. Okay. All right. I hear I hear clicking like. No, I'll pick the teams. Nope. And we're gonna go from there. R, hot dogs. Sandwiches. We're gonna say Trav says yes. They are sandwiches, and we'll say Shiv says they're sandwiches too. Me and Dajama are gonna say they are not sandwiches. Hot dog, two pieces of bread, some meat. Literally, the meat in between the bread. That's all you need for a sandwich. No, a a, no. a, a sandwich is not 
enclosed. A, a, a sandwich is two pieces of bread. I like you said, I like how you both said two pieces of bread. A hot dog has a bun that's one piece. Unless you break it, then you broke the hot dog. The hot dog is one piece of bread with the meat on the middle. And then, but it's still it's it. attached, but it's still two pieces of bread that are just attached. It's not, no, that's one piece of bread. So if, if I had one piece of bread, I couldn't call it a thousand pieces of bread that are attached, right? Well, so it's... you both did in your argument. You didn't even realize it. You both said two pieces of bread, sandwich. Okay. So if you folded a piece of bread in half and put some ham in there, would that be a sandwich? You no, need two pieces dog. of bread. If if you take a yeah. hot dog out of the package. Put it in the microwave, kick it out, put the hot dog on a plate, and eat it. What are you eating? I didn't pay attention to a single word you said. If you're you pull, eat, you're, if you're, 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 you're no, no bun, you put the hot dog on a plate and eat it. What are you eating, you're not eating a Sandwich. What, but what is it? It's a hot dog. You're not okay. A sandwich. If you have spaghetti and you put spaghetti sauce on it, what are you eating? If you have spaghetti. It'd be spaghetti. Okay. If you took the sauce off of it, what are you eating? Spaghetti. Okay, if I eat a hot dog and there's a bun on it, what am I eating? A hot dog. <laughs> you just made their argument. You didn't. You didn't say a hot dog sandwich. <laughs> no, you didn't say a hot dog sandwich. You, no, you're exactly it's not a sandwich. It? Exactly, We're in, not a sandwich. Oh, he just made. He goes. You made the hot dog sandwich. Them. Thank you. I did it because I don't think a hot dog is a sandwich. Thank you. Appreciate you. <laughs> I'm uh, bad at this, damn it. I mean, let's go. Let's. Yo, I hey. love how both of them start off with you. Have two pieces of bread, and I went, nope. Hold on. Let hey, me. So, let what me, is it then? What is I'm, a hot dog if it's not it's a sandwich? It's its own. It's a its hot own dog is a hoagie. No, thing. because you can't say because there's it's a bird difference. beak. He had a good point. He just said it wrong. There's a difference between eating a hot dog and eating a hot dog in a bun. But you don't. You wouldn't say a hot dog. You wouldn't call it a hot dog sandwich. But it is technically a sandwich because it's got. I did a really good know, job debating the wrong point. If if I if I was eating a sloppy Joe, I mean, you wouldn't call it. A I could say, in society, I'm eating a sloppy Joe sandwich because it's a sloppy Joe sandwich. It's not called sandwich. Okay. It's called man. In society, if I was at a Denny's, and I said, oh, "I'm gonna get the hot dog sandwich." Yeah. What was that for? Listen, listen, listen. Here's another good here's another one. Have to shit when you out. go you know, look on yeah. when you look on the menu, you have your <laughs> your sandwiches section. Yes. There's no hot dogs in that motherfucker. It no. Is. It's because it's, it's usually it what, what would the hot dog what the appetizer section? Hot dogs in the appetizer section. Probably hot appetizer. Hot dogs hot dogs no. Whole other section. No. Actually, you know what? You know what? Lindsay's at work right now. Call her. I'm about we're to not, look at that. We're not phoning a friend. This isn't her, her be a millionaire. Phone. Not only that. Well, wait, wait. What, what gives her the credibility to? Yeah. She knows yeah, she's going to look like, at the menu Lizzie, at the restaurant she she's working at. I know that. Crab, there's expert. no phoning a friend. We've all been to restaurants and looked at menus. Hot dog is never in hey, sandwich. This is gonna well, where is it at then? It's not an, not necessarily an appetizer because it's a main course. They don't put hot dogs in menus. Hot dog is an entree and kid's meal. Yeah, nobody buys a hot dog. It's on the kid's menu exclusively. Hey, no, actually, Trav, uh, our buddy, other Trav, that gets means uh, sausage, hot dogs all the time. He's a What's psycho. the answer? What's the answer? Sausage rolls. Hey, also, sandwiches? also, here's another thing. Nah, if, sausage rolls aren't sandwiches, right? <laughs> if another place, if you have a place that has uh, only hot dogs, and you're like, mm -hmm. hey, over in the corner, like at uh, Sure Shots. Yes. It's called right? a sandwich place. No, no. <laughs> they're like yeah they got they got hot dog sandwiches hot over dog there. Shop. So they got sandwiches over there and then you if you just say sandwiches yeah they got a sandwich over there you can get there's only hot dogs here where's the sandwich how mad would you be exactly. right how mad would you be you rolled up and it was just hot dogs oh it's a hot dog sandwich it's just glizzies it's <laughs> just glizzies. Sandwich. so wait if you had a hot dog between two pieces of bread is that a hot dog sandwich no that's... like if you're out of oh, buns oh, and you use two pieces like of bread, bread. Yeah, it's a hot dog yeah yeah that's if, a you, good... if you had multiple hot dogs and you put them in between two pieces of bread that's <laughs> a glizzy that. sandwich yes. hey, so yeah, what about because a baloney is basically a rolled out hot dog hot dog is not a sandwich Anna, hey, you are, bologna, you a hey, bologna is basically a, ro a rolled yeah. out hot dog, like a flat it's hot true. dog. Here's the, here's the only. And you eat a bologna sandwich. But you would never if, if put I was, a bologna between if, the buns. If, if I was at a hot Bologna's dog only, a hot dog only place, like down the street, Hot Dog Johnny's. If I walked up to Hot Dog Johnny's and I was telling the guy, he's like, "What do you want?" And I was like, "I'll take a uh, chili sandwich." And the, the look <laughs> he's going to give me, I'll take a chili sandwich. Oh, uh, some of the uh, no. the onions on my sandwich. He's gonna be like. Just get out of here. I'm not serving you. If you go sandwich. to a hot if you go to Johnny Hot Dogs and you say, Hey, what kind of sandwiches you got? They're gonna be like, 
We don't got sandwiches. Yes, yes. <laughs> we don't got sandwiches. Yeah, but 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 your point was perfect when you said if you told your friend, oh yeah, no, are you hungry, dude? They got sandwiches over there, and they your friend walked over there in the hot summer sun, and he was like, y'all only got hot dogs? Hey man. Okay, <laughs> so turtles people. turtles gave us the Merriam-Webster dictionary definition of a sandwich. The definition of a sandwich is two or more slices of bread or a split roll having oh. a filling in between. No. Oh. No. The only reason hey, I was actually going to bring no. the, I was actually going to bring this up. I was going to bring this up because no, it does make that... sense. If you go to Subway, uh -huh. if you go to Subway, Subway and sandwich, you get a sandwich. It's it's a big it's a split roll, roll. Yep. and it's not it's, roll. it's not completely split. Sometimes like, it splits and it's annoying as fuck. No, no, yeah, right, you're right. making our but argument for us. No, no, we're not. no, no, we're not. no I'm just, no, we're I'm not. just adding the element that Get is sudden. part of the separation of a sandwich and Here, a hot can dog. you drop this? That's not, <laughs> <laughs> that's not the the full. Just because a, a a bun is not split, does not make it a hot dog. Because you can't say with all these other ingredients, even if it was. I'm not gonna lie. I forgot I that I was supposed to be say. doing the four sandwich you are, argument. You, you are right. You wrote the definition, but we just—I yeah. mean, the Jama just pooped all over the definition. Yo, you go to Subway, they don't no. split it. So that's what they're talking about. That's what they mean. It's a no. subsector. But yo, hot dogs are not sandwiches. If you told your friend they have sandwiches, so what if, goes, so what if you made a dogs. what if you made a Subway sub sandwich, right? And you put all the normal shit on there. So hey, like a Italian sub. Turtles, will you look and up a uh, submarine sandwich and tell it's me tell sandwich. me what the difference between that sandwich. and a regular sandwich is? That doesn't make just, it. Just a... the hot dog does not make it not a sandwich. It's still a sandwich. So a hot dog, it's, it's, you're it's helping a sandwich me. You put a hot, hot dog on. by itself is a fucking hot dog. Right. It's not a sandwich. It's a hot but dog. But if you put it on a sandwich, dog. it becomes a sandwich. This is what you should have said. If you went to Subway and got one of those buns and put only hot dogs on it, is that a hot dog sandwich? It is. That's what you should have said. Yes, Santana, a hamburger a is a sandwich. A, a, a hamburger is a sandwich. 100%. Hey, hey actually, no. I would... Hamburger is a... Hamburger is no, no, a sandwich. No. It's a burger. It's a, it's a sandwich. This is... This, it's on a it, uh, according to the definition of a sandwich, it is a sandwich. Thank you. Yeah, technically. Because it's a, a bun is a roll that's split horizontally. So hot dogs are, are not sandwiches. Hamburgers are two points. I think we won this one from Marion. I think Mary we're not right. No, even with the even with the dictionary. Mary you told your friend so. they have no sandwiches. Went pee -pee. Yo, Dajama killed it. You told your friend they have sandwiches, and you walked over there in the summer sun, and you were like, "Man, fuck, y'all only got hot dogs." Eh, you're never trusting his opinion again. It's only yeah, hot dogs. yeah, that's sandwich. So here's the here's the old time debate: is that so the fact that the definition there it's 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 public opinion versus you know what that means like. They don't sell hamburgers at sandwich shops, but they do sell sandwiches at hamburger shops. <laughs> okay. I'm jealous. I'm jealous man. It's early, son. 12 yeah, it o'clock. It's 12.01 and 27 All right. seconds. All right. We did a little debating like animals. Ah, hey, Squadzy. Squadzy. Nah, where's your beer? Where's we your beer? Little... What? Where's your beer? I can't you drink just beer. got flexed on. You got flexed I on. I can't drink You're beer. You're hey, squads, what? you call seltzers beers hey, all the you time. Go get your goddamn vodka or something, goddammit. No, I could, I could make it there happen. There we go. There we go. All right, all right. I got a glass of OJ. We'll put some vodka in it. Hey, hey, uh, hey that's that's proper, proper. Hey, low key, those hot dogs are not fucking sandwich. <laughs> hey, yeah, me too. Yeah, definitely not a sandwich. I 100 percent agree. That would have been easy. David. That was a great argument. The whole hey, yeah, they got sandwiches over there. Yeah, hot dog think, sandwiches. I'm smacking uh, you. Being on that side of the argument, though, I would have been able to debate better than the pineapple, the no, or the four pineapple. Hey, know, dude, he's sure. done it perfectly both times where he picks the people who actually like that one. We all would have agreed with you guys. Yeah, yeah. But the last one, it was flipped. Like I actually like pineapple on pizza, and it's oh, I the, fucking hate. It's not been five minutes. He doesn't know. Uh, this. Oh, we we haven't told him. We haven't. You can't have wait five minutes between hey, each one. It's I so want to point out I flex all the time. Yeah, uh, <laughs> I'm always flexing. Hey, Squadzy. So this is a ongoing thing that we have within our friend group. Uh, whenever we're out, we're drinking, uh, whatnot. Someone flexes. Mm -hmm. The last person to flex has to drink, and you're yeah. allowed to do it every five minutes. Okay. And then there's and then there's Cobra Kai, like this. The Cobra Kai, which they're getting it too complicated. Weekend. It's only allowed in the weekend. Kevin's back. Herandura Ultra. This is the best tequila on the planet. 
tequila. Oh, you're doing a tequila yeah, sunrise. Yeah. Not. So fucking good. Not vodka. Ultra. I ultra. Fucking it's the you guys. Yeah, right out the bottle. Fucking you can chug it. It's wow. Fucking bitches. Suck my winky. <clears throat> Kevin made some homemade French toast. He put a hot dog on it and called it a sandwich. All right. Did he really? Yeah. Yeah. He made French toast, but I don't think he put a hot dog. On. I, need a I made that part up. Hey, made hey, could you make a, could you make a sandwich with French with French toast? Oh, for sure, dude. Oh, dude, that sounds banging. No, they have they sell them at like UDF. Do you guys have UDFs in New Jersey, Swazi? United yeah, Dairy was, Farmers. Uh, no, but I have had a UTI before. There you have. It's. <laughs> bro, it's the down. same thing, right? I got him, yo. I got to tell my and and I can sit with that, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much the same thing. I'm a great <laughs> character. No, you guys don't have United Dairy Farmers there? No, cheers, boys. Cheers. Um, UDF sells a French toast breakfast sandwich. Oh, that sounds good as fuck. It's like French sausage toast. and egg. Yeah, they have they have French toast and they have ones with little pancakes, like McGriddles, kind of. Jesus, so, he's making a mess today. If French no. toast this and reminds me of donuts, Island. if French toast and donuts make a sandwich, then... A fucking bun should make a sandwich on a hot dog. I've changed my mind. I've fuck, changed my mind. Fuck on this. you, Shiv. My own argument made me change my mind. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah, I just think that hit that shit. Fucking, he grand slammed that shit. He was like, "If you told your friend they have sandwiches, you know how pissed he's gonna be when he gets down there and they have hot dogs." <laughs> Especially yeah, if they man, listen, if they think hot dogs are disgusting these, too. These like. are all ones that we revisited from past episodes because it's episode two with y'all. So we were gonna okay. revisit them, and that is the we didn't have that argument last time yeah. that was the best argument where it was like holy shit if you told your friend they had sandwiches yeah. you killed hey, how, how did it go last time how the last uh everyone agreed that they're not sandwiches yeah. but but that was a that was the slam dunk argument right there yeah that was, that hey, was the... what we need to do is find some more <laughs> like split issues split uh debating questions i'm sure we can uh, that's find some that good dress ones. gold or Blue. I don't know. <laughs> that that meme that no, it was like it was like the way your eyes are. Some that. people saw the dress as gold and white, oh, oh. or gold and white, and some people saw it as blue and black. Or, or, I saw it as blue. Or, or, or the the Yanni. What was the other one? Yanni. Yanni and uh, I can't no idea. It, it I was Yanni and and something. And it was like, what do you hear? Yeah. And, oh and yeah, yeah, yeah. I had a friend like, yo, I swear to God, I don't hear Yanni. What do you? And I clicked on it, and it was. <laughs> like, oh, 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 you bastard! Got you me. got me. They got okay. me, bro, on that one. But what color one people see because I I saw gold. I got um. Well, no, I saw gold too. So it, it was gold and blue. Some no no literally sometimes I would see it as gold as gold and white, and sometimes I would see it as black and blue. It just completely depended. I think they did a scientific study on this and and basically <laughs> figured out that uh some it just has to do with the way your brain sees pigments. Track but no, the thing is, else. though, sometimes I would see it as gold and white, hey. and then other times I would see it as black and blue. Right, that's what I mean. It can change back and forth depending on how your are brain's Are we doing another it. debate, or are we moving on? Bro, Bronzy, that's, a on. that's a dangerous game, my guy. <laughs> are we doing We're going to move on to the challenges. Of the, yo, these challenges are going to be fucking great. Today. Are we doing the beans? I want to start with beans, yes. Yes. Hey, can I be honest? I fucking love using the word beans for, like, everything. Bean boozled. No, bean. yeah. You, 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 the wild animals are gonna try bean boozle now. Holy pop shit! Pop a bean out, and it could be fancy. cappuccino or liver or liver and onions. It could be buttered popcorn or rotten eggs. It could be peach or barf. It could be juicy pear or booger. There's a bunch of them, and this is full. So we're How not. Does this uh, work? We're not gonna. We're not gonna cap, cap, uh, get through you all. Gotta these. We're gonna have this for other episodes. Apparently, Look, you open it and then you pop the pop the top, bro. That little little knob. Pop that out. Yeah, but there's like a solid oh, thing shit. underneath it. This yeah. thing's fancy as fuck, boy. You gotta take the part of the whole container. This thing is cool as shit. Look what do you have point. to do, Shiv? Look at this. I don't know. I'm taking the whole lid off. So look. Oh, so look. look you rotate. Look. No, no. This is how you do it. I took look, the whole you, thing you out. You go, go down and pop it up. Down, pop it up. What? Oh, oh. I see. Mine's not jerking off like that, bro. Hey, got no, it. you gotta. You gotta rip the little tab out. The little thing. It untwists, Squazzy. Rip that off. Okay, rip that off. Oh, dude, and then it look, look. Smells like Go down. Shit. <laughs> Pop it up. It stinks. Ah! I got it off. I got it off. I'm gonna get. Oh, sick. that's cool. Yeah. And then it like puts one up. Oh no! Yeah. <laughs> dude, it does you smell stink, it too. Bro. Yeah. Dude, I don't smell a fucking thing, <laughs> guys. <laughs> there we go. All right, this one is either one. Is toothpaste or berry blue. 
I'm not even gonna look at the flavor. I'm hold on, guess hold it. on. Wait, wait. How are we doing this? What's what's the what's the thing? What are we? Focus how are we doing it. this? What's Focus our what's camera. our operation? Oh. All right. I don't know. So, Three, two, one. <laughs> I've either got peach or barf or juicy pear or booger or strawberry banana smoothie or dead fish or pomegranate or old band aid. No, this is hey. No, this is what we need to do. Oh, this is a disgusting. I've either got dead right fish. Too. No, what no. Stop. That? Stop reading it. Stop okay. reading it. What Just we're going guess. to do is we have to try to guess, what, guess it what it is, and then we'll look. Remember the oh, color. Hold on. You got to spit. You got to spit a uh, bucket. Oh, I can't look. Dude, I'm, I'm just going to eat them because no, I'm not going to be able to taste them. Fine. I should get a drink, though. I have no. Oh, I have my apple juice. <laughs> All right. Three. Did two, you eat it? Oh. One. No, fuck. Go. Go. I just Go. smelled it. Mine's good. Not good. I think it's good. I don't know what it is, but <laughs> honestly, that one was either fish. that was either toothpaste or berry rush, but it was good either way. It's like minty. Oh, I think mine was strawberry smoothie. I think mine was strawberry smoothie. As well. <laughs> oh, poor I think Squadzy. I think Squadzy got the bad one. What was it, Squadzy? <laughs> Dead fish. <probably. laughs> is it really that bad? <laughs> What was it? That was barf. <laughs> it was barf. Oh god. <laughs> He's crying. Oh my god. <laughs> Real. Not bad. Holy shit, it's that bad? You got me Bro. nervous now. Dude, mine's either all right, this one's either old bandage or pomegranate. Hold, hold, hold. wait, wait, wait. Y'all got fucking good ones, man. Oh, it's still I think, think mine get, was actually supposed me. to be a bad one, but it was hey, toothpaste and it just tasted like minty. All right, guys, go. I gotta buy bean. Go. You gotta buy bean. All right, you ready? All right, guys? mine's either old bandage or pomegranate. This is fucking. Oh my Three, god. two, one. Oh my god. Oh, that's gross. I got rotten egg. That one's old bandage. I'm pretty sure. I got another good one. I think. I'm fucking crying. Toothpaste. I got toothpaste. I'm fucking crying. I actually could taste that. It was definitely bad. I'm gonna get a bad one and freak the fuck out. It was out. old bandage. That was fucking disgusting. I've gotten lucky so far. Dude, oh, my shit didn't match the color of this. Well, the toothpaste. We'll do the toothpaste one's not bad. It's just minty. No, it's good. That's really good. Tastes like toothpaste. What? Well, do... Tastes like dead fish, what but it then? didn't look like dead fish. Uh, so I think I got. Uh, oh, I got a red one. What is red? Uh, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna join you in the next bean. It's either old. Hey, by the way, hey, look, look. If you keep the lid closed, if you keep the lid closed. You do it, and it'll push out just one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Do, do what? Keep the lid closed before you open it. Or do that. Now now do it. No, no. Keep oh, it. shit. Yeah. There you go. Bro, you're a genius. Oh, man, that looks like it's going to be. This one's I either dirty one. dishwater or birthday cake. Dude, this is old bandage or pomegranate. Yeah, same, and same fucking day. Fucking Dude, pomegranate. the old bandage was nasty. I actually did taste Cheers. this. Oh, this Cheers. is being boozled. Cheers. Cheers, boys. Three, two, one. Yeah, something's going on with my mic in a Zoom call for some reason. Okay, this is definitely old bandage. I got pomegranate. It's rotten egg. I think that's dirty dishwater. I, I think. actually don't hate it. It's not bad. <laughs> I think it's dude. supposed to be old bandage. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> <laughs> What'd you get? That's rotten egg. <laughs> I really hope I, I got get pomegranate. Rotten egg. I really hate pomegranate. <laughs> <laughs> Squadzy is probably gonna puke at some know. point. I don't know. If I, I want to. I want to see Squadzy oh, taste God. either the dead, the dead fish, dude. Oh fuck! No, I want him to try. Oh, uh, I like how he's got stinky all socks. Bad ones. <laughs> actually, I've heard someone's told me that the booger is not that bad. Like it's actually kind of good. Well, that's that's coming from probably someone uh, that eats his, their own boogers. Uh, probably. Fuck. It's another fuckable. Oh, speaking of which, I think I just pulled a, a booger flavored. Oh, no. what does this look like? I got stink bug or toasted marshmallow. That's Bro, you what this is. On, you get one. I got three. Look at this one. That's probably the same. It's, it's probably not... turd or something. No, that's stink that. bug or toasted marshmallow. Bro, hold on, hold on, hold on. Slow, down, down, slow, down, slow down, slow down. I feel like y'all are powering through. And the... hey, I haven't gotten right. a bad one yet. Do you see how many we got left? I got a couple like. Kind of bad ones. <laughs> All right, this one's got uh, cancer spots. That's either yeah, dead fish right. or... What is this one? That one's dead fish or strawberry banana smoothie. Oh, hell. Oh, what a focus. zoom. That's fucking I can't cool. Focus. Zoom. Mine doesn't want to focus. 
This one's, uh... There we go. Fuck me. This one's either liver and onions or cappuccino. Cheers, right. boys. Uh, Cheers. Yeah, ten, cheers. Oh, that's gross. It's liver and onions. Yeah, I think I got stink bugs. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. That's disgusting. That does taste like oh. stink bugs. Not that I know. It's that fish. Oh, God. David got lucky. Got... Squadzy, I think you got bar. Oh, is it dead fish? Yeah, it was dead fish. The one he had. Bro, it stays in your mouth for so long, too. Hey, Shiv, we keep getting the same uh, colors. Dude, the I liver and onion them. ones, it was fucking disgusting. It's still oh a little bit Yo, sweet, this shit though. ain't bad at all. It's still kind of sweet. I like it. The old bandage one wasn't bad either, honestly. I can't believe y'all are just fucking powering through these. Yo, after fucking last week, I think yeah. I'm good. This is much better than last week. I'm excited for the smelling salts. Personally. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Already did that. Hey, you're giving excited. it away. Giving right, it away. Right. We haven't talked one, about it. We're gonna do one more bean. One all more right. bean? No, we got like six Dude. more beans, oh, Playboy. Bro. Dude, no, we that that liver and onions one is disgusting. All right, all right, let's keep rocking. Fuck. Oh. Oh, try okay. the try the, the cappuccino flavored one, Squatzy. Hey. The brown one. I I got Mine's a brown like a one white. this time. I did it's get a brown one. Dude, no, that's not the brown one. That's dark. Oh no, that is it. That is it. That is it. It's either tutti frutti or stinky socks. This one's either bar for peach. All right. Oh, uh, mine's either Hold dirty on. dishwasher ah! or birthday cake. I want to try the dirty Yo, dishwasher. I'm, I'm so close to vomiting. Dude, I'm the fucking good. liver and onions one is disgusting. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Go. Cheers. Bean, bean boozled. I got cappuccino. That's bar. Oh, I got dirty dishwasher. It's stinky uh, socks. Dude, you haven't gotten a single good one. You seriously have not gotten. Squads, he's gonna mix up his spit one and his drink water. Oh, dude, that's so gross. The sock started off as like a fruity okay, and then the sock hit. Ugh. Hey, and we're, we're gonna do two more beans, and then we'll, then this is what we're gonna do. Oh. We're gonna do two at a time. That's what made that's what made Joker the, that's what made Joker the Jackal throw up though. Hey. He did so? multiple and immediately went. I saw a video. He went and threw up. Who is what it? if you get two good ones? Don't get the jackal. Who fucking cares? And if we throw up, we throw up. It's not going to be us. It's going to be you. <laughs> it's going to be me. Yeah, I don't want to do the two bees at one time, bro. You guys are powering through. I'm the only one that physically am crying. It's bad. It's not good, but it's it's dirty dishwasher. Oh I, I, think do, already... I really don't want the rotten egg. If I get the rotten egg, I'll be good. Dude, this right. is, this is the dirty dishwasher or, or birthday cake right here. I got this, this one that you just got. All right, I got either right. booger or juicy pear. I think pear. this is a yellow one. I don't know what it is. Oh, my God. Bean boozled, you motherfucker. This is the, the sixth edition, so they got two new flavors here. Here's my question. How the fuck did they like figure these out? They're like, test they're, like them. they have t taste tests. Like, uh, I just fuck, had a, dude. someone had to eat an actual booger. Is that the or, chino? I got the be booger one or the, is this uh, the cappuccino one, Trev. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. That booger dude, yeah. hope it's not liver and onions. This fucking nasty. Cheers. Three, two, Cheers. one, go. I think this is a good one. I think I got booger. It's not that bad though. Liver and onions? Dude, it's disgusting. <laughs> yeah, it's buttered popcorn. I got buttered popcorn. Yeah, the liver and onions was nasty. I didn't get one fucking good one. Yeah, you're, you're <laughs> getting shit on. Hey, you gotta keep trying. <laughs> Eventually, there'll be nothing but good ones. Listen, left. this is what we'll do. We'll keep going until, until... Squazzy gets a good one. No. <laughs> Torture. 100 gifted, I drink this. Oh my god, there's no way. <laughs> That's it? You're, dude, squads, you can't get gifted. You're on YouTube. <laughs> Why aren't you on Twitch and YouTube? Because uh, you're not allowed. Penises oh. and blowjobs. And... <laughs> you <too>. That's gay. <laughs> can, right. I just start, can I just start popping a bunch of these? I want to eat them in hand. Oh, go nuts. Don't yeah, get, yeah. Go nuts. Well, you not go yet. Nuts. Not yet. Not yet. I got a red one. Take a handful and and and, and oh, we're not gonna try to eat the whole jar because we'll revisit these in later episodes. Yeah, yeah. But I'm gonna take it at least three or four at a time. I want to. All right, right. Dajama wants to do it. Shiv wants to do it. You guys go do four at a time. I will. I'm walk. doing two After at a time. One. After I want to do two at a time. Oh, I'm okay. done with those. That, that liver and onion is I fucking fuck disgusting. Right, 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 got me too. Make sure you get a brown one in there, I Dave. Get, I literally don't good. know what flavor this could be. I didn't get one good one. It wasn't bean boozled. It was just boozled. I just got boozled. 
You guys tell me what flavor this could possibly be. Let me see. I, it I has no spots on it, and it's like pink. Oh well, hey bro. Hold on. That's um, it's the middle one. That's either. That's got to be dish. Or is that rotten I just, egg? I just tried the birth birthday cake one, I think. But you it said it's what color, cake. David? It's like pink. -ish. Dave. Dave, look. Oh god. That's probably old bandage or pomegranate. All right, all right, all right. Looks like looks like it's not a sandwich, Anna. Looks like it's not. Well, a we wanted. We don't want to do that many because we want to try to distinguish between them. Do three. Do we though? I, right. I mean, kind of. Bro, are you guys gonna like? How are you? I got three. I got, I got nothing but boozled. I didn't get one good bean. Hey, we might have the same ones again. Oh, no. Uh, I, I didn't get one, one good here. bean. Hey, get are your you bean ready? ready. Me? Oh, no, I'm no, good. Squazzy. I'm, I'm good. done. I'm done. Oh, bro. no, Squazzy, you have to go till <sighs> you get a good one. Actually. Yeah, for real. You should. Until you get no, a good no, one. you're doing another one too, Trav. Oh, God damn it. Yeah, that's right. We're in this together. Guys. I actually really want to just try the cappuccino, see if I can taste that one. Right, you guys three, did the death one. Two, one. Oh. Uh, they're all disgusting. All that's of them. Liver, that's liver and onions again. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that twice. <laughs> oh. That was buttered popcorn, I'm pretty sure. I think one of mine is bad. <laughs> Squazzy, how? Mmm. Mmm. That was, that was a good one. That's delicious. <laughs> Why were you gagging? <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's not bad, honestly. I think I had one. He gagged because he smelled the thing. Because I that smelled was the fucking. fucking I, I, I smelled the uh, the jar and it's vomit. I think but, I just had. Which one did you get? Squatsy. I don't know. It was delicious. I don't know what it was. It was delicious. It wasn't cappuccino. Was it? What color was it? I don't know. It was, I think it was, right. it, I think I was glad, a pomegranate. I didn't get it. It was pomegranate. I think it was pomegranate. Let's save the rest of those for next time. Yeah, for sure, for another uh, another show. All right, let's read the instructions on this. Fucking, All right, so we are moving on <clears throat> to a more extreme challenge. I mean, that was enough. I fucking cried. Um, woo, my stomach hurts now. We're going to move on to um, smell. Oh, smell. you have to activate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, mean you have water. To A it. teaspoon of water before and then shake well. Yep. Wait, what? Uh, do, one teaspoon of water. You says do not remove cotton divided. ball. Close the lid tightly and shake well. Uncap, Uncap sniff, sniff perform. perform. Hey, what? Hey, what are we doing for perform? Uh, we gotta do like. We're uh, on YouTube. Like can we see who squats. like completes the fa completes the fastest? Squats. Who what? Completes who, who the. Can... <laughs> can you do like sp are you just three, body squats? One, two, three, go. <laughs> I'm like, God, I'm like, I'm done. All right, um, so we're doing. We are the wild animals. We are doing uh smelling salt challenge. You guys get your water? Ready to add to it? I got water. I, got I, water. Don't, know, I, water. I don't know how I much a to... teaspoon is. I'm just going to kind of just no, put a little the spot. There's the thing. Okay. Do you, can you smell it already? No. You got a little thing. You're going to pour that in there. Hold We're going to activate the shit out of these. Oh, I'm fucking nervous about these smelling salts. It's pure ammonia. This is pure ammonia. I can't get the fucking spoon out. Is it really? Yeah, pure ammonia. That's basically going to smell like cat piss. Really. Do we wear gloves? Oh, no, it's going to be worse than cat piss. No, no. Cap it. Activate the... Oh, I'm fucking nervous. It's pure ammonia. Dude. I've had so much practice with this shit. This doesn't bother me at all. I got this. Oh, that's this. true, Anna. That's a, good, that's a good call. What if my, my jar got all bad beans and, like, two good ones? <laughs> I don't know. How long do we shake for? I think Dude, I can't get the we're fucking spoon out of here. It. I can smell it through the fucking jar. Oh yeah, it smells like cat piss. Yeah, you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna have to put this in a ziploc because this is not one time use. We'll revisit this. <laughs> Dude, I can't get the spoon out. Bro, I couldn't oh, either. I, it was hard. I can't get the spoon out. You got big fingers. Oh, oh, yeah, are, finger. Were you my doctor? Dude, it's warm. It's warm. It's hot. It's getting oh, it hot. Hey, we got to wait for Trav. We got to wait for Trav. It's fucking hot. There's this it. is, we're doing the smelling salt challenge. Wild animals on YouTube. Official Squazzy on YouTube. You got Trav3232 on YouTube. Uh, Shiv, are you on YouTube? Get, get Shiv. Get hey, Shiv YouTube and this is the Jama here. You can follow me on the road to my house. So you got, you can hang out with me because I'm alone. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right. All right. I got the fucking okay, spoon no, out. I'm heating up right now. It is getting uh, warm. My room smells like it. My room smells there's a, like it. There's a chemical reaction happening for sure. Yo, oh, wait, 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 wait. fucking really? Wait, wait. If we open, is it going to pop? I hope is, so. it, is it under pressure? No, I don't think so. Pressure. But if it's doing hey, a chemical oh, reaction, yeah. it might be. 
Trap, just oh, your... yeah, yeah, I'm oh, shaking it right now. Bro, am I gonna open this? It's gonna bust in my eyes. Hey, close your eyes. Well, don't look at it. it. You gotta yeah, open it. Open it real slow bust. too. Put your hand over the top like this. It's not gonna twist. bust. <laughs> yeah, I've said that to how many girls? <laughs> it's not gonna bust. I got at least another bust. three minutes. I'll tell you, I forgot. I didn't even feel it happening. <laughs> It snuck up on me too. Why are you upset? Is that a knockout stick in a bottle? Pretty much, yeah. It has a mind of its own. All right, so we are the wild animals. We are doing the <laughs> smelling salt challenge. This is pure freaking ammonia. Travis, yours warm yet? It's getting there. Hold shake on. Shake harder. Yeah. Shake. Uh! I, I'm like. Uh! <laughs> That'd be hilarious if the cap busted Should open and shimmy went. <laughs> Oh yeah! Apparently, um, your room's gonna smell for a long time. I gotta put this in a ziplock. I think this is a one-time use on the show because we can't keep this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I use this while working out. I'm gonna yeah. put it in my shower and just use it like once a day. I'm this going to not, wake. I'm to going to wake my lady up later on tonight with this. Let her nose. Yeah, that's a good way. That's a good thing. Or I'm gonna make my cat smell it. Oh, my cat's that's alone. probably dangerous. Nah, <laughs> I mean, it it smells like they're piss, ready. So it's fine. Yeah, I'm ready. <sighs> Three, two, one, go. What? Ah! Uh, get into it, Dejala. Get into it. Ah! Ah! Oh ah, my ah, God! Ah, ah, ooh, ooh, ah, ah, ah. That's my shit. That's my shit. <laughs> oh, dude, fuck kratom. That's what's better than kratom. Whoa! Oh, that burns so bad, dude. Whoa. Holy shit! It burns good. That's I'm gonna take shit. another. I'm gonna wow. take another. Hit. I didn't. Oh, I just, wow. I just did a little double dose action. Wow. I got chills. Yeah. I got fucking like whole back chills. That one was bad. Oh yeah, boy. That's my shit. Wow. I can see why they use this for fucking lifting. Woo. You've not. Ooh. Ah. Why? Oh shit! I'm gonna go bench press the car. Dude, my like. Oh, my nose ah. is clogged up on that side, so it only went up my right nostril. Whoa. No, you have to put it up the other one, too. You just put the Whoa. other one in there. It'll work. I just did it because I did the same thing. Yep. Dude, I took a little exploratory one on the first one, but that second one got me full blast. Oh. <laughs> Jesus, man. It only hey. goes up my right nostril. Squazzy. Squazzy. Something with your sound. Yeah, your back. Sound. Oh, there we go. Uh, oh, fuck. Are your oh, eyes watering? Hey. My eyes are watering, dude. Yeah, Yo. everything is watering. I oh. built up. Uh, How's your um, lungs feel? It's in my lungs. No, I didn't get it in my lungs. It's only like my nose sinuses are fucking on fire. Oh, that is fucking. In I'm sweating. Yeah, oh, I'm God. fucking sweating. So here's the thing with me. Wow. So when we worked at the uh, when we had the jewelry store, uh, our ultrasonic jewelry cleaner machine. Fuck. The, the solution that we put in Ugh. was distilled water, like, in a, in a base of that, we filled up, like, that much full of liquid ammonia. Whoa. And then, uh, then filled it up with, uh, and put some dish soap in there. Holy shit. And man. when you open that bottle of liquid ammonia, depending like on the... how much you pour, dude, it's the same exact shit, and I, like, Holy built, I got, boy. got built up with that. It fucking, I feel like I, 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 I literally, if my back was, I feel like I want to go downstairs and I could bench. Three yeah, times. dude. Uh, uh, right now. Turtles, it's called Ward Smelling Salts Bottled Ex Ex Insanity XL. Oh, I could, I could do, I could do 330 pounds on the bench with this, with a smelling salt, easy. Squazzy, how much was, how much was this? How much was this, Squazzy? I don't even remember. Let me look it up. I know, all right, yo, I, I, I know each person's package was a hundred and change. Are you serious? Yeah, this show is very expensive. You didn't, we could have got them ourselves, bro. No, no, no. Oh, <laughs> God. It, it only goes up my right water. nostril. It only makes my right eye water. So I have a, a snapped in half septum. Me so too, this bro. One's closed. Bro. Me too. <laughs> Dude, you have so many health issues. We you uh, we're gonna figure out your age at one point. I know hey, you have to. Hey, close one nostril and get the other one oh, up. It David, it will apart. not oh, go so, up yeah, that you one. You told me that. You told them snapped in half. It doesn't inhale through this one. So this one got all of it, and it's still tingly. Yeah, right in there. Yeah, right but in your sinus. You, I kind of want to take a bite. Vomit. Take a bite of it. Still eat a spoon. Eat the spoonful. I thought you were supposed to eat it. 
it did it it did immediately make me want to fucking like i i felt like i could take a car dude let's oh, play shit. call of duty dude it says at least six inches away from those I no dude mine was like an inch away, away. <laughs> but we were here i was like this was yeah like, oh god that was that listen I've Ooh, seen I've funny. seen videos online. I, I watched a bunch of videos last night as well. I've seen videos online of somebody inhaling this and immediately throwing up. I've seen people inhale and run out of the room. We handled that. F I, Are I you couldn't talking stop about yelling. pussies? I couldn't stop yelling. Woo! I don't know, like what? Yeah. Dude, it just burned really bad. Like it really didn't also, like do anything wow. other than burn. Imagine this in high school before you get into a fight. And you're like, you want to do what? Woo! Just take your shirt off. Oh, what if Squadzy like, accidentally inhaled it right there? Like, not <laughs> he went. <laughs> I just passed out. It's cap. It's cap. Yeah, I know, but what if though? Like, what really if it didn't warm, have to cap? and then uh, I was nervous that I would open it because it was so fucking. Like, Mine made a little. Tss. That was that wasn't as bad as I've seen online. Dude, and it... I feel like I'm cleaned now. Yeah, I'm very cleaned out. Yeah, I actually had a stuffy nose, so that was perfect. Did yours? Did yours make a little? Tss no. When you opened it, mine did. What I'm going to, all right, so you know how like, we have a bottle and you squeeze it and then you let go of the bottle, it inhales a little bit. I'm going to try and sniff a little bit of this later with my people. <laughs> I'm just gonna squeeze it and then put it to the tip and go, and see if it, see, you know, see if it helps. <laughs> I bet you that's going to burn real bad. Yeah, no, what if you like get chemical <laughs> burns on your dick? From... <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> I'm into some wild shit. It was um, a different kind of burn. I, I, I've never felt more like wanting to throw up and not actually throw up. The beans mixed with that, like <coughs> that was so worse. Bad. That was worse for you than the damn death nut. No, the death, death nut was nut. horrible. The death nut had me doubled over for four hours after the show on my living room floor. You, I, I sent you guys you all a Snapchat of me with my runny fucking nose yeah. after I puked yeah, yeah. my guts up, dude. Dude, like my I'm eyes were all red. I've, I've I've done on the show. Well, when we closed, when we closed the podcast, you guys sat and talked for a minute. I as soon as we closed, I closed. Yeah, you closed, were gone. Yeah, and I went out there. I sat. Like fucking, uh, like downward dog style, uh, in my living room, just like, oh my god. The next thing I did, I don't think I, oh no, I think I mentioned it in our, in our Snapchat, but I, <coughs> went, I needed food because I didn't need it all. I didn't need it all, and that's what really got me. Oh yeah. But I went downstairs and I couldn't eat yet, but I had to try to eat something. So I went and got broccoli and ranch, and just was eating little pieces of broccoli. <laughs> We're putting ranch on on it and just eating it small yeah. as I go. Went to the kitchen, finally made some eggs as I was still doing that to get something in my stomach. Dude. I powered through uh, two cups of yogurt, um, a bunch of almond milk. Nothing was touching it. I could tell you in my intestines where it was. Oh, yeah. It was like well, a hot piece so, of hot lead. Yo, I legit, I asked Alexa what to do. <laughs> I was like, Alexa, what do you do if the uh, fucking... Ah. Super hot, burning your stomach. Just like drink a lot of water, two bottles of water. Started drinking water, and my my machine it's super cold. So when I drink the water, you can feel it. You can feel yeah. it. Yeah. And it was like alleviated <coughs> it for like you know ten seconds or something. But you yeah. had to keep drinking it. But it was trippy. It was trippy. It's weird to feel something in your stomach. You're like, oh, it's yeah. here now. Alexa, and shut up. It's here now. It's moving. <laughs> <laughs> That's not. Uh, he's yelling at his daughter. Her name's Alexa. <laughs> <laughs> no, like, don't, don't, don't let him fool you. That's right, his well, imaginary and friend. She just, she just knows everything. One yeah. more sniff. Yeah, one more. I'll, I'll do one more. Yeah, it's it's okay. not that bad. It's really not. I think it's gonna help us with Call of Duty. Uh, Turtle said it increases blood flow to your brain. He just looked it up and buy some. This is why we need to be fucking sponsored. <laughs> I love it. Okay. <laughs> okay. That is amazing. Wadzi, try like it like it. this. I like it. That is amazing. Ugh. I'm addicted to this now. No, you hold it away from your face, like, and then you go, and that's, that's way better. Hey, way so better that way. Let me tell way. you something. When going back to the jewelry store thing, we had a fucking tank about this big, full <laughs> of liquid ammonium. Full. Bro, about I'm addicted. That, that wide around. Did you take a bath in it? No, but here's the thing. They gave us this pump. Dissolved the body in it. You open the thing. They gave us this pump that was fucking awfully made. Awfully made. And there was no way to not spill some somehow. Oh. Dude, one time it was not working and it spilled everywhere. And it it stunk up the whole. And oh. we're kind of in an enclosed area in the back of the store, right? 
Shit was leaking. Everywhere, bro. Went outside, dude. You could not be inside at all. Like, it was that bad. It was, it was. It's like wild. cat piss. I don't think it smells like cat piss. No? Like, Read more of your chat. I also said that that Ward brand has killed people. Oh, yeah? Turtles, yeah, I don't see want, where you, you said that, bro. You don't want to sniff too much of it, man. I mean, it, it's ammonia. You yeah, can't, yeah. You can't overdo it. You bro, what is like? Uh, my dad said, Squadsy's where, Squadsy, where's your beard? On my, on my ball sack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, on my ball sack. I like the idea of just your ball sack as hairy, not the top part of it at just all. Just the sack. Yeah, yeah just, you shave, yeah. you shave nice just and the clean root. on the top. Has it, the has sack a, is like an it's, afro. It's, it's shaped. It's shaped. Yeah. Root. He's got it nice and like deep. Turtles, you, so you never it said that it kills people. Yeah. Just the root. I do have a Manscaped 3.0. I swear by that product. You can just run it over the bag. No worries. Well, that's Sponsor literally us. what they what Manscaped. they advertise. Like right. shave your balls. Yep. Don't use a lot of it. Okay. Yep. You did not say, but you just for the record though, you didn't say that. At least I didn't see he, it. You just said it kills people. Yeah, but he said that he said it kills people. But I just don't see where he wrote that. You can overdose on it. You don't oh, I'm sure. Yeah, it's not. It's not great for you, especially for your lungs, dude. There's literally like, boy, it's like poison for your lungs. That's not, um, that's not that bad. So tomorrow, um, when everybody wakes up and they're like, "So wait, Squazzy's Squazzy's dead." You know, you mean dead. that's my that's my father. That's Mister Mister Trav three two three two. You mean Squazzy's no longer with us? He's dead, dead. Okay, yeah. killed him. That killed him. Okay, Squazzy nineteen forty five to twenty twenty two. <laughs> Fuck you. 1945. Squads, he just don't want to grow his beard out because he knows it's going to have more gray than mine. Hey, man. You know what I mean? I, yeah, maybe I'll snap you my, uh, my, my, my down south beard. You know what I mean? Don't worry about it. Yeah, uh, Turtle said you, uh, you can have a brain aneurysm. Uh, not lying. Talking about brain aneurysms last night. Brain aneurysms running my family. Multiple family members have had them. Ooh, that I've had maybe you should not do this anymore. Straight. You probably have a brain aneurysm. You should probably not do that anymore, bro. Yep. Brain aneurysms are something very common in my family. Yo, imagine I just go. That's not, yeah. That and we have no it. way to contact your wife and let her know yeah. that you're. <laughs> do you guys know how famous the three of you would be? The street <laughs> live Squanty! podcast. Squanty, no. Died. No, we'd probably be charged for murder. <laughs> no, murder. 20, minutes in, 20 minutes into you guys figuring it out, Trav's like. Yeah, we we were like we were like do it again, you pussy. <laughs> Get up! Wait, he he passed out. Give him more of the smelling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. My wife walks in. You're like, listen, he's passed out. Give him more smelling salts, and she's waving it <coughs> in front of my face. Put it up his butt. Turtle Turtle said, "Squads, you should definitely not use it then." Yeah, um, it runs in the family, like legitimately. That's not a joke. Like multiple aneurysms in the family. Yeah, I think I heard like aneurysms. Like my dad's had strokes birth. recently with lesions on his brain recently. So there's a lot of things about the brain. Yeah, let's not do that again, Squad. Why don't you go ahead and just throw it away? <clears throat> I am a little dizzy and my left eye hurt. My <laughs> so my right eye my hurts. Face is starting to droop a little bit. <laughs> You're because you literally that's funny though because your deviated septum's on your right side, mine's on my left. My my le, my right eye hurts. Your left eye hurts. My shit is in, in, in pain right here. Uh -huh. We're good though. We're good though. I feel pretty good. I feel great. Nobody makes me bleed my own blood on the floor. You know what I mean? <laughs> they just We're grab fine. grab the bull by the horns, you know what I'm saying? He's like, you know, uh, <laughs> he's, uh, that actually I'm happened. Do it in a minute. He's like, I like to get a brain sweat as well. <laughs> he's reading it upside down. Are you reading the dictionary? Yeah. I like to bust a mental sweat as well. <laughs> you no, know, he, scoot, he scoots towards her. <laughs> <laughs> Right before she comes in, he pumps up his. Yeah, he pumps his up. <laughs> He's a grower. <laughs> I love that. What was the lady's name with the brow? Uh, um, the brow was in her name. Slav brow was in her name. It was no, like, it wasn't. It was no, like Slavanka. Was... Slav no. Slavanka or something like something that. Here, I'll look it up. Like Hold on. Yeah, yeah. Are we talking I, about dodgeball? I, I, Ivanka. Yeah, yeah. It might be so Ivanka. Ivanka sounds right. And it's then true. her last name, her last name was like. <laughs> oh, you you are right, Santana. So um, I had an allergic reaction, uh, months and months and months ago. Uh, Santana was over the house, and uh, Alex was over the house. We're all just hanging out, and at the you know, end of the night, I'm you guys are upstairs. all wrong. I'm in the bathroom upstairs, and uh, 
next thing I know, <coughs> I, I was just going to the bathroom. I got done. Next thing I know, my lady comes into the bathroom and she's like, how long you been on the floor? And I'm wedged in between the toilet and the tub. And I hit the toilet so hard it pushed it. Apparently, I passed out, smacked my face off the window, fell back into the little space in between the toilet and the tub and pushed the toilet. I, I hit it so hard with my fucking face. So I wake Jesus. up and I'm like, what do you mean? I don't, I don't know how I got down here. So I passed out hard. I've had that happen the next before. day, she called me upstairs and she's like, what was your face print on the window? Oh so hives broke out everywhere. Major fucking hives. What were you allergic to? So what we thought was, let's run through the night of what happened. Everybody's hanging out. We had a big party at the house. I had tequila. I had Chick-fil-A sauce. I haven't really drank tequila my whole life. I, I, I puked when I was 18, so I stayed away from it. Now I started drinking it recently. So I'm like, maybe it's tequila. Maybe it's Chick-fil-A sauce. So I was like, you know what? If it's tequila, and, and my lady's mother's a, a retired nurse. She goes, if it passed you out, that means your body's that allergic to it. The next time you try it, it'll kill you. You, you could probably die. She's like, so whatever it is, let, let's just, let's. I Don't like, drink tequila. As squads, he's drinking tequila with. I go, if it's tequila, I'm going to figure it out. So I took a shot. Everybody's like. Hi. They're having EpiPen. Hives everywhere. I was like, yo, y'all got to go. I got to go to the hospital right now. <laughs> so it was either tequila or Chick-fil-A. So I downed some Chick-fil-A sauce. We're going to figure this out. <laughs> uh, you know, we're going to figure this out. Come to fucking find out. I'm riddled with fucking big like raised fucking hives i can't breathe i'm passing out come to find out it was fucking <laughs> oxyclean really oxyclean has a chemical in it that has actually killed people before are you talking about for like clothes yep. there's uh, there's oxyclean so your clothes, clothes had uh, been washed in oxyclean so i washed them in oxyclean and i did the did the laundry i washed them in oxyclean and some of the clothes still had like almost like a salt little like spots on it but oxyclean didn't wash out all the way so as I was wearing that shirt the whole day, the oxyclean You were slowly absorbing it. And I'm so deathly allergic to oxyclean. If I ever use it again, she said, you have a high possibility of dying. It passed you out. Your body was shutting off to save itself. Dude, that's scary. Because what if they're using it like in hotels? And, you you know, they wash the bed linens with it or the towels? The meeting the Lord. Because, yo, I was, I was on my way out. Well, you need and to get an EpiPen then. He was like, come upstairs, come upstairs. I was like, What's up? She's like, look at the window. You just see my smushed face. I was like, that's where I hit. Yo, you almost got million dollar baby, dude. Yeah, bro. Oxy hey, I've got a story. I got a story, similar story. Um, so I got home uh, when I was in college. I was like, all right, Brendan, we'll see you later, brother. Hey, yeah, good job. Good right. stream. I'll so, catch you guys later. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was like a raging pothead at the time. And uh, I got home from where I was delivering pizza. I got home from work. I was sober as can be. I'd been working for, you know, nine, 10 hours, something like that. I get home and I go to take, I go to walk downstairs. I lived in the basement and I trip. And the way my stairs were, it was like three steps that came down in like a curve like this. So it was probably six foot, uh, or between the top step and the bottom step, it was only about four, three and a half, four feet, but I'm tall. I'm a tall guy. So when I tripped, I fell about six and a half, six feet probably. And landed on my knees and my arms like this on the bottom. So I didn't even hit the steps. I just went straight to the ground, landed on my knees and my uh, hands. And I already had a broken wrist in high school. I'd broken my wrist and it had never quite fully healed right. So I landed perfectly on that wrist and it was just like it went numb instantly. Obviously, it went numb. So I like dragged, I'm like, ah, I dragged myself to my chair and I sit down and I'm like, fuck, man, that hurt, you know, but I'm okay. And I take a bong rip. Take a big bong rip. I'm like, I'm like, ah. Oh. And then I'm sitting there watching a YouTube video a couple minutes later, and I'm feeling my wrist just because it hurts. I'm like, I'm just like rubbing it right. And this bone right here, this big bone, I feel it. I'm still looking at the screen, but I feel it moving, right? I'm pushing it in and out. I feel it moving, and I can still do it to this day. Honestly, I can still push it around, push it around. But uh, the next thing I know, I woke up on the floor. And I was like, what am I, you know, I, I was like, it was almost like waking up from a dream. I was like, where am I? You know, I'm on the floor. I started looking around and all the stuff from my desk was just scattered around me. So apparently I'd face planted downward and then just like <laughs> took everything off the desk with me and went to the side and just blacked out. I have no idea for how from long. What? Nobody was there just from the pain or like from realizing that my bone was moving. Oh, yeah. yeah so like yeah, I realized yeah. that I could move my bone around and I just blacked out. Ha, ha, ha.
And I woke up on the floor like, what the <laughs> Now, did you go to the hospital to fix it? No, no of course no, you didn't. I never, no, I didn't do shit with it. It's fine. <laughs> I mean, it still cool. moves. I can still push it around. Is anybody else losing vision? No. No, right. I'm not losing any vision. I'm good. Hey, come say, take some deep breaths, bud. You get some fresh air in you. It's just me. <laughs> like, I'm looking, I'm like, oh, man, everything's real blurry, and then it comes back into focus a little bit. And oh, goes, well, that's my three. camera. That's just my camera. <laughs> no, your camera's been doing it the entire time. It does you it, yeah. How does yours not do that? That's my question. He's got a $600 camera. <laughs> it's a product. That's cool. I mean, mine, if I move in, like, a couple inches, it goes out of focus. Freaks out. Um. So I got a crazy story about seeing someone break their arm. You got the turtles. Uh, Santana, yeah, you were probably gonna have to carry me. I was in a bad spot. So I was a uh, high school wrestling my senior year, and I'm up next on this on the mat, and uh, this these two kids are wrestling, and this kid grabs this guy uh, like by the waist, picks him up, and goes to like suplex him, kind of basically. The kid comes back, reaches his arm out, and it hits the mat, snaps here. His elbow goes around, and then his shoulder dislocates, and his fucking hand was, like, over here. Oh. And it, dude, I saw, like, I saw it, and it instantly <laughs> was this big around. And you wanted barbecue spare ribs. But yeah. <laughs> no, it, like, the kid weighed, like, 140 pounds, but his arm was, like, the rocks. It was that big around. And... It was like a whole ass thing. I'm up next on that mat. They bring in all the squad or whatever. You know, it's like an hour later. I finally go to wrestle and I'm like, ugh. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, my arms are like, ugh. You're like, you want to draw? I broke a friend's elbow once. Nice. Did you? That fucking we, bitch we were, had it uh, coming. We used, to get, we used to get in the living room and we'd, we'd lay the mats down because we were doing jujitsu. <clears throat> and uh, I got him in. My legs are around his waist. I'm behind him. I have him in a Kimura position. He's like this. I have the Kimura. And I was like, just tap, bro. Like, we're literally just training around. Just tap. Like, learn to tap. And he's like, no. And I went to go apply a tiny, tiny little bit more. Just like this. And it went. Wait. Oh. And it snapped all the way around. Damn. And he screamed. Uh. I jumped up. And I go, get a towel. So we're going to get a towel. This. And I go, bite this. And I put my foot here and my foot here. And I go, three, two. And I pulled as far as I could and it went, he located wow. it and then he goes to the hospital but literally dislocated the entire elbow where it went all the way around that's oh. like fucking 12 weeks at least it made me want to throw up it, like you always see in movies like snap the elbow and they're just like yeah it, I was like, oh my god I heard it I heard it. I felt I felt <laughs> it fucking release and just fucking pop yeah and then that same friend um I went to go because <laughs> he was chin down trying to stop me from getting the rear naked choke and I went in and I knocked out one of his tooth. Granted, um, he had horrible teeth. And then that same friend a little while later, the reason why we stopped doing training at my house was I've got him in a rear naked choke and he's not tapping. And we're, we're all watching. Everyone's just like, just fucking tap. Stop being a dick. We learned to tap. And I go, you're not going to tap? And I just sat up a little bit. And as soon as I sat up, he started having a seizure. Oh, my gosh. So I let him go. And he just, he's just like this. And then he stopped. And I didn't move. And then he... he this what the fuck happened? And I go, you had a fucking seizure. I go, we're not training at my house anymore. I go, we're done. We're done doing this. Yeah, yeah. There was uh, one friend that I, I went through a little bit of, but I mean, you got to learn to tap, right? Yeah, oh, yeah. You know? Um, All right, boys, that was a lot yeah. of fun. I think it's, what are we, two, two, two hours and 40 minutes in? Yeah, yeah buddy. I'm booting up COD. I don't my know about you guys. Uh, oh, I'm booting up COD. I'm booting up COD. You guys booting up COD? No, I'm uh, going to. I got, I'm, I got, I'm busy. Like, we have All lives. Day. I got shit to do. Rude. <laughs> uh, i'll have to see rude but like we like pussy i'm like okay i like it too i you know, i get i get that you do. one more sniff no no squatsy no <laughs> kevy said he'll be on at 1 30 he was expecting <laughs> us to do that what if we would have all been like yeah, yeah totally that's what like, like no, shoot he passes it. out apart from me who like coffee the way i do um i like my coffee i used to like it with a 16 scoops of sugar and a lot of cream. Now I like my coffee with just black with a little drop of cream. That's how I do it, too. Like a little cream. A little drop of cream. I don't want it to be... Dude, coffee with that, that vanilla Premier Protein shake, dude, is... It's so good, bro. Little little drop of cream, Anna, in my coffee. No no more sugars, nothing like that. <sighs> I am going to be going over to Twitch, though. 
I'm going to be pushing over Twitch. What? I'm going to get up. I'm going to gonna stream on Twitch. I'm trying to fix my situation. It's literally like I'm I'm not it's not focusing. I'm having some issues with my, my, my eyes. And then I'm going to jump on Twitch. All right. I love y'all. See you guys. Bye. Good show. Good show. Hey, if we'll anybody, see y'all. If he nope. has a stroke on, on camera, make sure you clip that. Oh, I will. I will. Yo, I, I, I'm so His last dying thing is going to be hitting the clip button. I'm so entertainment yeah. minded. I'd be like, clip it. Clip it. Clip it. Yo, you, want me, you want me to eat a cricket? I'd be dead. I'd come back and I'd go, clip it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dead. Done. All right, y'all. Love y'all. I will see right. y'all uh, next go around, man. We are the wild animals. Hey, hold yes, on. Yes, sir. Rip squad. Wild animal. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We're out of here. Love y'all. See you guys.